Okay, audio check. Quick audio check. Okay, another test. Okay, let's do a sync check. We got one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. Looks like we are good.
hello. Good morning. I'm gonna change the music real quick because the entry music is a little bit loud. Okay, this is a bit softer, but... Hello, good morning, good afternoon, hope everyone is doing well today. I am feeling great today. You know why? Because I've been sleeping a lot better. <laughs> yeah, I did add the new channel for redemption. I'm glad you saw it, so... I think... I think Connor Eats Pants has a redemption for like 10k, 100k, where it's just like... Donate to the Connor Eats Pants funds, and it's, it does nothing. It's just to flex your point, so... I think it's fun. I think it's fun. But I hope everyone is doing well today. Um, I don't have anything new, really. Like, nothing too crazy. Like, I got a lot of sleep last night, so I am feeling great. I oh okay. Has did anybody watch the Creator Clash event? Because I remember I watched. I think as fans like the pre meeting for it, and then that was the thing that made me want to buy the pay per view ticket. I think it was like twenty five bucks, like thirty dollars after tax. But it was a great event. Like, I know, like, collabs and, like, hosting events are, like, the new meta of Twitch. But if it leads to, like, good content, I'm all for it, you know? <laughs> yeah, gotta keep distracting yourself, right, Issa? Okay, so today, we are playing Mario Kart. But as you can see by the title down here, chat is going to make me lose today. And in order to do that, so today we're not doing a challenge run, mind you. We're, we're going to play normally. I'm feeling good. I want to get some W's today, so I'm playing normally. But there is a huge but here. For today only, for anybody who subscribes, cheers, gifts, or donates, you will tamper my gameplay. Meaning, exclamation rules in chat for anybody coming in. As you can see up top, the little chart will explain what happens when you do something, right? So, I think what we have... Is it... <clears throat> what does it say? <laughs> I, I, it's so, like, small. Okay, so for every $5 dono, I will wait at the finish line for 5 seconds. I think that is the worst thing. Like, just waiting and seeing, like, everyone pass you, the worst. And then for every 100 bit cheer... I will, like, immediately fall off the track or intentionally spin out, so, like, I will intentionally look for, like, a banana peel or something. And then, um, for every sub or gifted sub, I will use no items for the rest of the race. So, we're only doing this today. If people like it, they will do this occasionally, but not every stream for Mario Kart. But before we get- <laughs> I, I well, I didn't do this too early. But before we start playing, I have an announcement Chatters want it. You guys begged for it because I know you guys want to play with me. But every month we will be doing the Mario Kart tournament. So this month's tournament will be on Sunday, May 29th at 11 a.m. Warm up start at 10 a.m. Because that's similar to the birthday stream. I will like show the code in chat starting at 10 a.m. PST. So for this tournament, as we can see in the graphic that I made myself, guys, any streamers, if you need a graphics artist i will gladly do it with pay mind you with pay i do not get paid with clout i see some shit and i'm like honey you need like a graphics person please i will gladly do shit for you but it is a no items tournament because the issue we found last time is that having items definitely like ruins the fun of everything so we're gonna try and do items for this tournament this month on sunday may 29th at 11 warm-ups open at 10. also if you place top three, you will get VIP for a month until the next tournament. So guys, you guys have a week and a half. Practice your lines, practice your skips, because this is a no items tournament. So make sure you are ready to go. So that is going to be not this Sunday, but next Sunday, May 29th. Anybody excited? Anybody hyped? Okay, so that's what I was supposed to say before I explain the rules for today's stream. That's an oopsie, that's an L on my part. This is a dental reminder. This is what we're doing. For anybody who cheers, gifts, donates, you can affect my gameplay. We are going to be running predictions today. So in the command, it does say doubters eating good today. So basically, if you guys gift, it'll make me lose. That that's what's gonna that's what's going on today. Okay. So similar to like any Mario Kart stream, I think we're gonna start off with computers, and then go into online. I'm actually scared. Of what? Of what, hun? 
You have nothing to be scared of. <laughs> okay, I need to be doing pre's that I don't have three stars in. I say this every week, but I need to practice those specific cups. Let's start with this one. Let's start with this pre. Let's go ahead and get our first prediction up of the day. Go Gamba Chat. Go place your bets. <laughs> I also changed the um, <laughs> prediction answers. What do I have? What do I have? I think the predictions answers are yes, she's a bro gamer, or no, she needs to get good. Gentle reminder, prediction is for top three, guys. Top three. <laughs> okay. I did play a little bit of Mario Kart offline over the weekend, so I was able to practice a little bit. Nothing too crazy. Ah! I'm gonna hit! Dude, I hit the block, but I totally saved myself. Coming to the stream, exclamation rules in chat to get a brief overview of what we are doing today. We're playing normally. Oh, okay. That line was horrible, but I actually saved myself a little bit. Okay. <laughs> that was a little bit sad. I am I'm sorry. I can do better. Hi Matt, welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing well today. Exclamation rules to get a brief overview of what we are doing. The lowest score was an 82. That's actually insane. That's crazy. That 82 is the lowest score. That that is hard to conceptualize, like... Okay, come on! I've fallen off twice already. Like I said, I'm warming up. This is my warm-up race. We're doing 200... <laughs> We're doing 200 ZZ, the warm-up. I've gotten some comments saying that people will never play 200 CC on their own, but I genuinely think 200 CC is the best way to play Mario Kart. This... Yes, this map, I hate this map as well. It, it's the dog shit. <laughs> I mean, visually it's creative, like the aesthetic is really nice, but playing it is not nearly as fun. Okay, top, top three is in my reach, guys. Oh, we got a ball! Sorry, I got excited. <laughs> Let's fucking go. <laughs> I am a pro gamer. <laughs> Sorry, just seeing the, the banner where it's like, yes, yeah, she is a pro for the prediction is so fucking funny to me. Okay, on to the next one. <laughs> Dude, I love predictions so much. I think they are so fun. Oh, new prediction is up. Go Gamba chat. Go place your bets. <laughs> Sorry. I- <laughs> I tried to drink way too quickly and I just spilled all over myself. I'm fine. Hi Nyx, welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today. X ah! Exclamation rules to get a brief overview of what we're doing today. But congrats! How how the frick did you actually get a hundred? You are insane. But I guess the setting pays off, right? <laughs> oh dude, Mario got sniped right there. Oh my god, I'm not even trying. I I I literally all of the pre's in this. Okay, not all the breeze. I hate all of the tracks in this pre. Like, they are not fun at all. They are absolute dog shit. It's fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Like I said, we're warming up, we're warming up. I, ca I can't be getting too mad right now. Get a lot of extra credit. Oh my god, you want a 60? Okay. <laughs> that that's actually insane that your grade went up that much. That is crazy. Yeah, last week I procrastinated on all- literally all of my homework. 
So I, I did everything on Sunday, and surprisingly, I got everything done, and I got a solid, like, 75% on everything. So I, w I was happy. No, I- it's a- I literally hate this map. This is my least favorite map in the whole fucking game. I think it's partially because, like, it's in a literal sewer. Like, it's- you're actually driving through literal shit right now. Blue shell, envy, envy to the game. Please just do it. Just do it. Somebody do it. This is one of your favorite ones out here? Guys. I do not condone such positive slander in my chat room. <laughs> Get back in first. Whoa, what happened there? Okay, we're fine. First, come on. I want to get a three star on this map. Come, come on. I'm literally right there. Literally right there. Easy. Easy, guys. I am so fucking good at this game. Oh, shit. It's like... <laughs> Dude, there's still water all over my shirt. I... I'm sad. Okay. Okay, sorry. I'm trying to do this. I will sing a song. Okay. We can do that. Ooh, okay. What song should I do? I was thinking about it. Yes, she is a pro game. Okay. So, I need to think... Of a song to sing. If you're new to stream or new to Twitch... I'm gonna go ahead and link a help article that explains channel points. Oh, okay, I spelled that right. I was like, why is it not coming up? <clears throat> okay. So let me find a song. <clears throat> I'm not a phone streamer. I'm just looking for a song. I am not texting. I'm not answering emails. <clears throat> Also, my voice is kind of messed up today. You can tell she's a little bit raspy. I'm getting a lot more sleep than normal. So, I am not used to this. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I know which one I didn't want to do. How does it not have the lyrics? Yeah, I know the lyrics for this song. It just wasn't showing up. There it is. Okay. Okay, so I think I'm going to try Take a Bow by Rihanna. <laughs> Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? If I could get some Meg spins in chat, that'll make me really happy, guys. Okay, honestly, honestly. I like looking at chat and seeing emotes. They just make me so happy. Okay, um, no more stalling. <clears throat> I fucking love emotes fam so much, guys. Today's been a great fucking day. Today's been a great day. Okay. Enough of that. I, I love the song so much. <clears throat> it's definitely one of those songs to where you can kind of like almost speak sing it. That's why I like a lot of like R&B type stuff. Because to me, like songs in general, they're essentially like not more creative, but more like they're like Spoken word poems, right? Like, songs are just poems. That's what they are. <clears throat> okay.
Okay, yeah. There we go. Thank you, Nyx, once again for redeeming that. I appreciate it. I need to show off a little bit, you know. Okay, back to gaming. We're playing fucking Mario Kart. Let's go back, back to it. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> if you are coming into stream, exclamation rules to get a brief overview of what we are doing today. Oh, prediction. Let's get a new prediction up, guys. Okay, new prediction is like, go place your bets, Jack. Go place your bets. Did I get first this last race? I got first, right? Dude, if I get a three-star gold trophy, I'm gonna be so happy. It's gonna make my day even better. 69 in doubt? Come on. Come on, there's not even handicaps today. I can definitely get top three doubters. Come on. <laughs> okay, talking about getting more sleep. So my doc was like, hey, Megan, maybe you not sleeping every night is, like, contributing to your anxiety. I was like, probably, you're right. So, doc was like, hey, you should take melatonin. And I was like, okay, I can try that. So on Friday, I <laughs> I found some gummies that were 10 milligrams of melatonin. And it said to take two of them. Apparently, 20 was way too much because I woke up on Saturday having, like, some really wild and crazy nightmares. So I was like, let's not do 20. But I was able to, like, hit REM sleep, which is, like, something I'm never able to do. So, for the past few nights, I've been taking melatonin gummies. And, so guys, guys, if you're wanting to, like, message me or, like, add me on Twitter or something, my office hours are now 9pm, because I, I have to be in bed by 10. Oh my god! Thank you for the gifted sub, Mike! I appreciate it! Turtle got the gifted sub, let's fucking go! Okay, what was the gifted sub? It was, um... What does it say on screen? Oh, no items for the rest of the race. Okay. You always knock my mom out. What? <laughs> Not me. <laughs> oh, the, the gummies. Okay. I was like, guys, what are you talking about? I was getting a little bit concerned. But yeah, I was playing um, Mario Party with my sister on Friday night. And that was the night where I took the 20 milligrams, right? And I took them at like 9. And we were playing Mario Kart till 10. And I was like literally falling asleep. Everything in the game was hilarious to me. <laughs> So it was a good time, it was a good time. Okay, no items. Okay, I literally got a coin. Literally worthless. No point. But yeah, hopefully we'll see how me getting more sleep affects my life. Because honestly, I've started biking every day as well. And I have been feeling great. Like, I'm feeling a lot less tired, a lot less depressed. Let's fucking go. <laughs> so... I am feeling great. I know last week I did skip a day on stream. I, did, I switched from Thursday to Friday. First, let's fucking go, guys. Let's go. No items. I don't need fucking items. I am way too pro. <laughs> but once again, thank you, Mac, for the gifted sub. You're going to go ahead and get your name ready to end a stream as well in the journal. Let's go. Uh, what was I saying? Like, as you know, like last week, I wasn't feeling too good because I wasn't getting sleep, but maybe... Getting good sleep every night will fix my depression. <laughs> so we'll see, we'll see. Okay, so this race, because I think for the stakes that we have up top here, they're only going to, like, attribute to the current race that I'm doing. Because, okay, honestly, honestly, I wanted to farm a little bit today. I will be transparent, I wanted to farm, okay, okay. Okay, new prediction, new prediction up, guys, top three. I am on track for a three-star gold trophy for this pre, which I've never been able to do. And this, mind you, is 200cc. We got 10 points, I believe. Let's go. Okay, guys, th this track is so easy. Everyone shits on Rainbow Road. Like, ooh, Rainbow Road is so difficult. But this one genuinely is the easiest Rainbow Road in the whole game. If you lose on this track, you're, you're a total club, basically, is what I'm saying. Yes, there are, like, barely any garbales. Oh! Sorry, I drifted the wrong way. <laughs> Rainbow Road is a flat. <laughs> Actually, you're right. <laughs> oh my god, I fell off. I fell off close ratio. Guys. I'm okay, I'm in I'm in fourth. I can come back. We're, we're not too far behind. No! No, come on, last stretch. Please, I really want that gold star. Where's first? Okay, they're right there. Not too far by Mario as a boombox. You cannot get too close to them. Mario has a bad touch. No! No! Come on! Please! Give this 
to me, please. I'm right there. I'm right there. No! <laughs> no! I was so- Wait, who got first? Who got first? The universe is so unfair. I know. I literally had it. I literally had it. Why is club censored? Um, I have auto mod on because I don't have any mods. Let's fucking go. So it automatically catches any words that are somewhat negative. So I'll have to like manually allow pleb, but you're fine. I pleb is not meme, so I would have gotten 12. No shot, Nix, you're lying. You're literally you're gaslighting me right now. You're lying to me. <laughs> Dude, I'm a pro fucking gamer. <sighs> I, I did do good. I was distracted. I was distracted. No, I do have gold Mario. Because I think for gold Mario, you have to have, like, a certain amount of gold trophies, right? <laughs> because I think I have gold trophies in just about every pre from, like, 50 to 150 CC, I believe. Let's actually check. Look, we got a two star. I was genuinely so close to that three. It was like in my grasp. I had it. I literally had it. <laughs> go home. What's what's the meme where it's like go home, cry to dad or something like that? I, it's a meme, right? I, I know the phrase, but it's, it's, it's on the tip of my tongue. Yeah, let's actually look through. Yeah, I have gold trophies and everything. Like, right now, I'm just focusing on three stars. Ooh, yes. Dude, I, I thought I had silvers at least, but I got some solid goals. You 100% in the game one night? You're crazy. <laughs> like, I think the speed running or the speed run. <laughs> For, like, getting gold trophies in all pre's and then the time trials is like eight hours or something. I could never do that. That's insane. Like, I would like to get into speedrunning, but also, I don't have that much dedication. Your new predictions up. Go place your bets, guys. Thank you. I like it. <clears throat> it's actually because it was teacher appreciation week last week week last week right so my mom she's a para so like some of the parents they brought in like treats and like goodies for the teachers and one t one parent gave all the teachers like little cups and stuff but my mom she has literally way too many cups <laughs> i think we have like no joke like 10 of them in the kitchen so she's like megan you can have this one and i was like let's go because like this cup is actually really nice because it's fairly lightweight and it does have a handle so like my weakest hands can hold it and not like drop the cup because the other cup i had it didn't have handles and like just the cup by itself is really heavy and i've gotten really close to knocking it over sometimes and it's got lemons on it so it's adorable I am so bad at this track. I'm literally dog shit at it. I'm not good. Oh, I saw Baby Roll is gonna try and throw the green shell behind him. I saw that. Can we, can we get her? Easy! Okay, I know I said over the weekend I would try and get another wallpaper done. I was gonna do it yesterday, but, um... Because, <laughs> like, the way my schedule is, on the days where I do stream, so usually the Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, I usually don't do much after stream. Like, I usually just chill. Because, like, being on camera for, like... <laughs> um, being on camera is, like, exhausting to an extent. So I usually just chill, and then, like... I think Saturdays and Sundays are for homework, and the Mondays and Fridays are for, like, editing. So usually if I- No, oh, come on, I'm right there! Please, please, please! Another blue shell! Metal Mario's so far behind me! Yeah, we're good. We're safe. We're safe. 
for sa for saved. Uh, what was I saying? So like usually if I'm able to get like editing done, then I'll like do art stuff. But I spent because like my goal yesterday was to get enough like clips videos done <clears throat> for like a week. That way I can like chill this Friday and like do art. So I edited for like eight hours straight yesterday. So let's go. <laughs> At least I got sleep. Yeah. I am so- I was like ragging on like melatonin because my sister, she takes the gummies every night. So she was like, you know, Megan, you should try it out. And I was like, no, I don't do drugs, even though melatonin is not really a drug. Your prediction is off, go place your bets, chat. Because <clears throat> like she will take a gummy at like 8 p.m. and be out by like 8.30. <laughs> oh, I did it too early. I know I did it too early. But like she has a job, so like she needs to, she has to wake up at like 5 a.m. every day to get ready to go to work. It's actually insane. But I'm glad I'm finally like able to get sleep now. Like I thought like I've always had like issues with insomnia. It's because like it's not that I necessarily have like nightmares, it's just like I said it before, but I feel like when I sleep, I feel like I'm wasting my time. That's why <laughs> Oh come on, come on. I feel like if I'm not awake and doing something, then I should be doing something. You know what I mean? So like that's why like if you have me on Dude, he literally fucking sniped me! That's why, like, if you have me on Discord, I'm usually active, like, all day, because I just have it open. I usually just have it open. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm holding true to my values. I did not throw fire behind me. I did accidentally throw one behind me, but, you know, I... I'm diligent, and I only did it once. Oh, once? You gotta try everything once, you know what I mean? I think a Benadryl? Why... <laughs> is this what happened there? Literally, what happened there? Because, like, I've never had to take a Benadryl, thankfully, because, like, I never had, like, a severe, like, allergic reaction to anything. Oh, wait, I have to think. Maybe I took it once for, like, because I used to have, like, a really bad pollen allergies when I was little. But that was when I was asthmatic, so it made sense that, I, like, pollen fucked me up. But, like, it, it's so funny, because, like, oh, so she can sleep. Okay. Because, like, my mom, she's allergic to, like, shellfish. So anytime she goes to like a takeout place, she has to take a Benadryl because like you can hope that they won't like cross contaminate food and like clean utensils or clean the stove up, but you know they don't. So anytime she goes to like a takeout place that sh that serves any type of seafood, like she has to make sure she takes a Benadryl. Okay, that was close. That was way too close. I threw it at the end, but you know I got a first. I got a first. <laughs> But anytime she takes advantage of she's just like immediately dopey, immediately like tired, and it's so funny. <clears throat> That's another first, guys. Hmm, imagine you're in a good mood, therefore you play well for once, actually. Who knew? <laughs> Okay, not saying that I'm in a bad mood whenever I stream. I'm just really tired. But, you know, I'm well- Okay, is that the only thing I'm gonna talk about today? Just me getting, like, a decent amount of sleep? Is that, like, what I'm- Is that what my stick for today is gonna be? <laughs> okay, predictions up, go Gambit chat. I'm complete dog shit at this map. But I've gotten only one second today. way too fast i think what i no items what i'm trying to do today when i'm racing is try and minimize how much i'm breaking like i'm trying i'm trying in general to rely on breaking less because i have found that when you like fully lean into your drifts and your turns you're able to like keep your momentum going and like keep your speed because the issue i always have is when i break too much i i slow down way too much and then I fall behind. So if I'm able to, like, keep my speed and stay in the front, then hopefully it'll increase, like, my online performance. Because I- I know I'm horrible at online, I need to get better. And I feel- I hit, I hit. <laughs> hopefully I feel like no breaking will help that. With show coming, nothing I can do. Literally nothing I can do. Oh! Okay, this is actually really good that I landed here. 
Didn't lose too much time there. Oh, of course I get a good boombox right after the Lucia hits. But you know, we still get a... We had a boombox. <laughs> I love this game. I, okay, honestly, honestly. Another boombox, what are the, literally, what are the odds? How have I gotten two boomboxes in a row? I've never had this happen. I've never been this lucky. Okay, honestly, honestly. I feel like Mario Kart is so good at farming glyphs. Because there's been way too many times where I'm like, Oh, look at me, I'm so good at this game. Or look, I got this item and then I immediately throw or I lose it. it it's genuinely so funny. Like, I think, like, some of my favorite streams that I will watch, even if I don't know the personality, like, I can watch someone play Mario Kart for, like, hours and be happy. So, if any of my streamer friends, if you play Mario Kart, even if it's not your main game, I will sit there and watch you. <laughs> that sounded weird. I will watch you. No, not- I did not mean to threaten. That is not what I meant. You guys know what I mean. You know what I mean. <clears throat> okay. Dude, please give me a three star gold star three star gold trophy please please i want it so bad wait no it's the battery maroon it's this one i hate this one so much you guys do not understand how much i hate this track yeah today is my day i was okay i was genuinely so excited to stream today yes i got this prediction is up go place your best chat go gamba because I would stream more days a week, but honestly, chatters, be honest. You would get tired with me, of me if you saw me every day, right? It's kind of like how you can't necessarily hang out with your best friend every day, right? The good- No, this is the worst Rainbow Road Hacker. I don't- Literally, all your takes are bad takes. I, I will- I will say it, Hacker. They're all bad takes. <laughs> um, but as I was saying, like, you- you can't hang out with your best friend every day. Like, like, you're gonna get tired of each other. We need a break from you. I know, right? <laughs> So, like, I I hate this track so much. I, I what happened there? Um, oh, I got ghosted, Sag. Just like IRL. Um. Oh, wow. <laughs> what was I saying? So like, I might do four days a week, but I like the schedule that I have now, where I do a different like main game every day. Cause like, I was thinking about it, and like, a lot of my like streams have like a shtick to it. Kind of like the um, Super Mario 3D World run, and then today's how, like, I have, like, the incentive for, like, people to donate, which is fine. Like, I think it's fine to do that. But I think <laughs> my favorite stream segment has to be Animal Crossing. Because it's a segment where I can, like, invest more time and, like, like actually look at chat and, like, have, like, deeper discussions. Like, I think that segment of stream definitely does ground me a little bit. Because at its core, Dude, come on! Streaming should be, like, engaging with your audience in a way that is, like, genuine, right? And I feel like, while, I, while I'm still really small, I should appreciate that! <laughs> and, like... Not take advantage, but, like, make sure, like, I'm appreciating my chat room as much as I can. Because, like, okay, right now, I, I literally can't, like, attract, because one, this is Rainbow Road, and two, I need, I need that three star. I literally need her. Um... <clears throat> So I know I'm, I'm not looking at you. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> See, like, okay. I need to, like, put money aside for, like, uh, a monitor. Because my... Please, a first place. Look at that shit. Look at that. Finally. This pre has been haunting me for ages. For ages. And I finally got... The three star gold trophy. Today is a great day. Today is an amazing day. So, <laughs> see, it's so fun. No, I think it is fun because, like, it, this track, since it's so wavy, it does keep you on your toes. But I have never been able. Th this pre has been haunting me for ages. Uh, anyway, as I was saying earlier, I, I see your messages now, Nyx. But yeah, I like the Animal Crossing stuff too. It's, it's cute. I think it's so cute when you guys will play. I know I don't play with viewers, but it's so cute when you like play the same game at the same time. It's really cute. It's adorable. 
Dude, look at that. I got a three-star gold trophy. Look at that shit. Look at that. Oh my god. Okay, let's do another one. <clears throat> um, what was I saying? Because I do definitely put, like, a more, I guess, animated personality on stream, and more so for, like, the Mario Kart segments, like I'm, I'm super extra right now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna like frizzle out after probably like an hour, but <clears throat> it's still really fun. Cause I think at its core, like streaming is entertainment, right? So like you should be having fun when you're doing it. Cause you ever see like a stream and like the person is just like not enthusiastic or kind of mid, kind of boring, right? I mean that's just how some people are. But also, I know me as a viewer, I like the super extra people. I like the energetic people. Because, like, if I see that someone is having fun genuinely, then I'm gonna have a good time as well. Okay, prediction is up. Go place your bets, chat. Also, if you're just coming into stream, exclamation rules in chat to get a brief overview of what we are doing today! Oh no, <laughs> come on! I am horrible at this drag. I, I will never be good at this drag. Like, I know this bike build does allow for sharper turns, but still, I, I need to get good. I sit up there. Imagine if I just started like stomping in anger. <laughs> no! What? Why are the computers so good today? I've literally gotten stuck four times now. That is four. Exactly, like when they stop when you hit them with the net. Exactly. <laughs> oh, I had a lot of stuff happen over my island over the weekend. So guys, look forward to Animal Crossing today. I don't. I, I had a lot of stuff happen. If you were following me on Twitter, you already kind of know what happened. But it was a sad day yesterday. Is all I will say. That's all I'm gonna leave. Come on, third place. Come on. First, baby. Sorry, I'm so loud. My dad is home right now. He's probably like freaking out. He's like, why is Megan screaming so much today? He's like, why is my child obnoxiously happy right now? <laughs> Come on, first! Dude, let's fucking go! Let's go! Dude, I am popping off today. Like, genuinely, I'm doing so fucking good. We <laughs> have two polar opposite people. Probably. Hi, Emmy! Welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today. Exclamation rules to get a brief overview of what we are doing. Happy Tuesday! It's Tuesday, bro. <laughs> wait! <laughs> Correct a cart. Can I change that? I want to change the new prediction answer to Megan is actually correct a cart. I'm changing that. Correct. Wait, I gotta do all caps because I'm yelling today. Is cracked an approved word? Yeah, okay, new prediction is up. New prediction is up for this next race, guys. <laughs> the, the yes answer is now cracked at cart. <laughs> that's too good, Nix, that's too good. <clears> okay, <throat> new predictions up, go Gamba chat. Okay. Dude, I hate this dragon. Anybody like this drag? I think it's mid. I think it's called like C tier. Wait, 669 points and believe. Good job, chatters. It's alright. Your second favorite track? You're literally lying right now. I mean, you are gaslighting. How is this your second favorite track? 
as a permanent believer, I'm eating good. You're right, you're right. Didn't I put in, I think, my goal life that doubters will eat well today? And I literally have not taken any L's. E tier? Okay, I agree with you on that hacker. This one is a C or a D. We agree on this one. It's so fun to do all the jumps. True. It is. It, okay, I agree. It, it is fun. It is kind of fun. I think it's fun to do in the moment, but it's not like... You know how you can... Oh my god, Rosalina trying to stun me again. Computers are mean today. Okay, I don't know why I thought that using the boombox on the mud would work. I thought like the mud would just dissipate, but then I realized it's a part of the track, so no way it'll disappear. I think like this track is definitely fun. But it's not one that you can boast about being good at. Like, I am pretty good at Neo Bowser City, and that is, like, surprising to people. So if I'm like, dude, I am totally correct at Neo Bowser, people are impressed. But if I say I'm fucking goaded at this track, people will be like, sure, like, little five-year-olds can do it too. Like, you're not impressive. <laughs> no, blue show, blue show coming. What am I doing? Like, nothing I can do. No, come on. Okay, I... <laughs> I was gonna say I'm sad, but I'm literally sitting here smirking. <laughs> Cause like, all I could think about was we had zero points in doubt. But imagine, imagine if one chatter put 10 points and they got all 600 points. I, I appreciate your support, Nix. <laughs> Lost 500. No, how predictions work, if there's like zero points on the other side, then you just get your points refunded. <laughs> Clean. <laughs> Okay, no three star gold trophy on this free sad. And of course it was on the, the race I didn't think I would I used to be I used to be amazing at this turn, but then I I, I unlearned how to do this turn. Get back in first, I can hold. Dude, I almost fell off right there. A list of topics that I wanted to talk about today, but I'm genuinely just trying my best to focus right now. I'm like, I, I want to win. Okay, there we go. I, I remembered how to do that turn. You just have to break way too much. behind them. They're they're all so evil. No! I was gonna do the turn perfectly that time. Easy first. <laughs> Can I just say, we're still playing against computers, but this is why I'm doing so well. <laughs> I'm gonna be absolute trash at online. Or maybe, maybe I'll do great at online today. We don't know just yet. Yeah, I've been practicing the shortcut on this track, Hacker, like, a little bit. Like, it's still hard to get, like, the line right, because it's at the end, because you're right, like, at 200, you don't need the boost. 
but I am so accustomed to not going for the skip that I kinda have to relearn the ending part of this track. F to your map. I think this one's fine. Like, I used to hate this one. It does make me want to yak a little bit. Like, the, the turns are a bit too much. Okay, I was not going fast enough. <laughs> I got the line right, but I, I, I threw a little bit. I'll, I'll go for it every single lap this race. There we go! Come on! Yeah, I got it, I got it. Easy. Okay, that line is pretty good. I'm getting better. Like, it's definitely not the most difficult to skip in the game, but I think it's the hardest to learn. Dude, that ritual has been coming towards me for a long ass time. Where is it? Okay, it wasn't for me, I guess. <laughs> oh, the dragon one? There's a skip? Oh yeah, there is. There's, it is on the grass patch. Baby! Okay, that was rude. I think he outran the red shell. Maybe. Or maybe it's for someone else like far behind me. What did I get? I got third. God damn it. Wait, I still got believers. Let's go. Believers still win. Let's go. This is probably gonna be a regular gold trophy. Maybe a one star. No way it's a two star, because I think I got a fifth and then a third. So it's probably a one star, if not a zero star. Let's say... Yeah, it's a zero star. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Okay, I think we can... I want to do one more pre with computers. I, I want to gas myself up a little bit more before we do online. But before we head into the next pre, does anybody know what time it is? Anybody know? Anybody? <laughs> yes, it's ad time. Yeah. So we are about an hour into stream, so you guys know what that means. I need to fulfill my contractual obligation and run an ad. You can avoid that ad break by subscribing for just $4.99, just $5 a month to keep your coffee and get ad preview. Gotta go, no problem. I enjoyed hanging out with you today, Hacker. Hope you have a good one. Yeah, use your Twitch Primes. I'm getting there. <laughs> if you link your Amazon um, Prime to your Twitch account, you get a free Amazon Prime sub. I know my Prime sub went out to Rainy Games this month. Guys, it's literally free. It's just like five clicks. You can go ahead and click that link. That'll help you link your accounts. Anyway, we will see some of you guys in a few. Okay, let's go. Back to racing. We're gonna do one more pre with computers. Yeah, time to get a snack. Exactly. Get a snack, get some water. You don't need chatters passing out. We don't want that. I like this pre a lot. This one's really fun. <clears throat> okay, new prediction is up. Go place your bets, chat. I feel like all the DLC tracks are pretty easy. The only one that was kind of difficult is the Ninja Hideaway one. Because there's like way too many paths, but otherwise, it's not that bad. Oh, 
I jumped in the wrong way. Come on. Genuinely so rude. Do you want a vacation without you? No, how could it? Okay. I have lived with my parents for like forever. Like, I have yet to move out. But like, I know it's gonna hurt when I move out and I see them going out and doing shit without me. But then it's also like, if I went on vacation with them, would I have to pay for my own chair? Because <laughs> like, I don't think we ever really went on like vacations. I think we only went on like two vacations when I was little. Once to like Yellowstone, that was a road trip. And then like we would go to Hawaii for like funerals. So like we never really went on like a super fun trip. Cause like yes, the Yellowstone was supposed to be like a fun trip, but like being in the car for like two, three days straight was not fun. Like that is not a vacation. And like we were camping, we didn't like stay at a hotel, so like we we got to the campsite and we had to spend like two hours like set every, everything up and like everyone was already like super tired. Three days, yeah. Okay, the story time with that was it was only supposed to take like maybe one or two days. But the car kept breaking down because we went during like summertime, so like the car kept overheating and like okay love my dad but he likes to get like old used cards that aren't reliable like he knows how to fix it but also it's not fun so like it would break down like every few hours like it was annoying obviously annoying for my dad but like everyone else in the car was struggling oh we gotta get a new prediction up okay new prediction go place your bets if you get sick on every vacation that sucks honestly you probably could have been like the airport Cause like, even pre-pandemic, like, I feel like, when you go to the airport, there's just like, way too many people, like, traveling, like, internationally as well, so like, it's very easy for, like, bugs to get around. Oh, that was cool, you guys see that? I rammed into the villager and he got my red shell. That was pretty sick. See, I don't know about all you little zoomers, but when I was little, I ate dirt, and I, I played in the garden, so like, my immunity was pretty solid. <laughs> like, I think I only got sick like one or two times in school, and that was when I was like literally like yakking. But like, I think my anxiety was like... Cause like, when you miss school, you're behind on like a whole day's worth of assignments, right? And you miss on the notes, and like, nobody's gonna take the notes for you. So I didn't miss a lot of school. Yeah, exactly. I feel like a lot of people don't realize how, like, how many germs and, like, how dirty the outside world until, like, you actually start looking at shit. Because, like, even when I was little, like, my mom would teach me, like, when you're leaving the bathroom, like, after you wash your hands, like, open the door with a paper towel, that way you're not touching it directly. And, like, she definitely taught us a lot of those little, like, like tricks and habits when we were younger. So, like, we were already, like, doing that shit pre-pandemic. But as you said, a lot of people don't think about it. Dude, that was an easy W. Easy first. <clears throat> Go, new prediction! Okay, it's up. Go place your bets, chat. Dude, we had 1k on believe the last prediction. You guys are crazy. <laughs> Come on, we need doubters. We need, like, a little bit of doubters. Ooh, I was thinking of, like, a shtick I could do for Kirby stream. I, can't, I cannot doubt. I appreciate that, Nyx. We love our, we love our believers. Um, I was thinking of a shtick I could do for a Kirby stream. 
And I think once we beat the main story, I think a fun, like, challenge run would be, um... Because you know the Coliseum where you, you, um, fight all the bosses? I think it'd be fun. Like, okay, I'm gonna run the title. Nobody snitch. But the title will be, like, if I don't PB, I do this. So essentially, I'll be, like, speedrunning. Or not speedrunning, I'll be doing, like, the boss run over and over again for, like, two hours straight to, like, try and get a better time. And essentially, if I don't PB, I do something. I think that's, like, a really funny concept for a stream. So, like, I'm trying to think of, like, what stake I can do. Like, I don't want to do anything too embarrassing, actually. Like, I don't want to do anything too crazy. That sounds cool. Yeah, I think it sounds fun. Oh, I almost fell off. Because, okay. An idea I had for a Kirby stream when I was initially, like, planning it out. Because, like, I know we're just doing, like, a normal playthrough. We're not doing any stakes with it. So, like, Kirby is, like, our normal game of the week, right? Like, something I wanted to do was... Um... Every time I get hit with something or I take damage, I, like... I was, the, the title was gonna be, like... I play Mouthful Mode IRL, and it was gonna be like a play on like Chubby Bunny. Except any time I like took damage or something, I would put like... What's it called? It's those like little hard candies that are sour. Those ones, I forgot what they're called, but like I would like put one of those in my mouth every time I took damage. So like as the stream goes on, like my mouth is just full of sour candy. <laughs> warheads! Warheads! They're called Warheads! But I thought, <laughs> I thought that would be like really funny for like a one-off stream. So maybe I can do it in the future. I think that would be funny. Uh, but then I was like, I I'm not good with sour candy like at all. Like I would actually be dying in the video game and IRL. It sounds torturous, yeah. But it'd be funny. I should do it. Yeah. <laughs> I'll do it. I'll, I'll do it at some point. Yeah, I literally will have no taste buds. Literally. I think... Because, like... You know how people will have sub goals for, like, if we hit the sub goal, I'll do this stream. I think that concept is cool. But then I'm also like, if you have an idea for a stream, just do it. Like, I can understand how, like, incentivizing it is, like, a good tactic. Welcome to stream. Hope we're doing well today. Exclamation rules to get a brief overview of what we are doing today. Um, what was I saying? <laughs> oh yeah, I think it's it's fine to like incentivize like a stream. But like I said, like if you have an idea, just do it. You know, my theme song. <laughs> yeah. Do I'm getting a bomb first? Like, essentially, if you're just starting out with, like, making content or just, like, creating, like... Dude, there was no notification! There was no notification. I'm stuck. Oh, I said rules. It's in the title. R-U-L-E-S, not goals. <laughs> I just can't talk. That's my problem. Dude, no items, no items. Basically, if you have an idea, just do it. Like, don't break the bank, mind you. Like, if you have an idea that's affordable that you can do, just do it. Cause like, I'll hear a lot of people be like, "Oh, I do. I want to wait till I have more viewers or like till I have a larger audience." But like, if you have an idea, like, if your idea is good enough, then like, people will come and watch it. In my opinion, because like, I feel like a lot. I changed how I title my stream. Please first. Easy. Um, I changed how I title my streams because I know a lot of people in chat are like people who have seen the stream before. Like we have a lot of regulars now. Let's go. I appreciate you guys. Um, but also, um, you can use the idea twice if it's good. Yeah, like that's kind of like, um, kind of like how like. For Mario Kart streams, like, for the past couple weeks, we voted on what challenge I want to do. Because, like, I think it's a good enough shtick to keep doing occasionally, you know? Um. But. I think. Like, I've tried to, like, clickbait my title as much as I could. Just to see if I could get more people in. And it's interesting to see, like, what 
Like, what specific shoes will make someone click on a stream, right? Or what specific titles? Because, like, just in general, the um, SM3D World Run, where I had the title every week, is it, every game over I give subs. Like, usually that stream gets a lot of clicks. So, theoretically, it's people who don't necessarily know me, but, like, they like the title. Like, the title is pretty fucking good, right? Um, so, it's interesting to see, like, how the dynamic changes like even just like a simple thing by changing your title or like adding some type of like stick or steak to or steak to your stream i think is oh what what am i doing this is not what i meant to do oopsie regional <laughs> it adds a lot dude i only have five kill points i need to get good yeah we're doing online now it's it's the the sad part of stream. I'm spectating. Okay, we can show we can show for a little. We can chat. Um, I was gonna go up on another tangent. Oh, okay. Cause like, okay, streaming, right? If you think about it, people like your personality, right? So it usually takes a while for people to start liking you. Kind of like, for example, if I read out to somebody three times. Like, people aren't necessarily going to follow that person they read out to right away, right? Because they don't know them, right? Because the whole appeal of a stream is that you're hanging out with, like, a friend, right? So it takes a while to, like, start liking that person. And to me, if you want to have new people come into your stream and, like, gradually like you over time, I think your premise for the stream has to be, like, digestible and understandable when they come in. That's, like, why any time I have, like, a challenge stream, not today necessarily, like, it's not really a challenge stream, but, like, that's why I have exclamation rules. That way anybody coming in can, like, understand what we're doing today. Kind of like how I talk about Ludwig all the time, but he is a great example of a lot of his content is digestible, right? Like, people immediately know what's, what's going on, they know what the stick is, they know the plan, right? And it's such a good, like, format for stream, in my opinion. And yes, people will be there for like the giveaway or like the big part of stream, but also like a good handful of people will stay for like normal stuff, like where he's just doing the gameplay or reacts. Because over time, people will like like his personality or like commentary style. So th that is my goal with doing more like challengey or staky type streams, kind of like the Super Mario 3D World run. Like, yes, it does bring people in that might be there for just that stream, but hopefully, over time, people will, like, either like my vibe or, like, the chat's vibe, so. Because, like, I was thinking about it this morning, and I was like, is my content too baity? Because, like, I know the premise of, like, giveaways or gifting subs is, like, really enticing, right? But then I was like, you know, I'm not giving away real money. I'm not giving away, like, products, so I think it's fine. Um, yeah, like I, I was thinking about it this morning. Like that was my morning like shower thought. So I was like, am I doing something bad? Not that it's bad, but I'm like, I'm like, am I manipulating people? <laughs> <laughs> but I feel like most of my people in chat are people who like are already subscribed, whether it be like they're a paying sub or like they got a gifted. So it's like. I feel like the people who stick around will stick around. I don't know. I don't think you're doing anything wrong. Yeah, I I don't know. It's just like, I haven't gotten any shit, mind you. I haven't gotten any criticism from anybody for like any stakes that I'm doing. It's just like, in my own head, I'm like, hmm, I was just being critical of myself, I guess. But I appreciate it, Mac. Exactly, just become goaded and never give subs. Exactly, that's the plan. <laughs> okay, guys, we are changing the prediction to top six. Gentle reminder, it is now top six for the prediction. I've seen people do worse click of it, yeah. If anybody, like, peruses a TikTok live, some of the live streams are crazy. Like, um, I saw that, like, Hassan posted a screenshot of a stream on TikTok where like the title was I'm making a B-O-M-E and that was like the clickbait for the TikTok live and it's like what? How? How? Like that is insane. Um, 
So, like, I will never do anything that crazy. Like, I'm not actually, like, insane. <laughs> Yeah, TikTok lives are literally a whole nother world. Yeah, I'm in 10th, let's fucking go. How <laughs> they fell off. He's <laughs> like, I would like to invest more time into a TikTok live, but I honestly don't feel like it's worth until I get access to like the desktop application. Like, I just hate streaming from my phone. It's annoying. Dude, I'm in second! Oh my god, oh my god, I'm in second! I- I just can't have anything nice. Like, not even for, what, five seconds? Before something happens. <laughs> yeah! Like, I think those type of streams where they're like, ooh! Like, it, it's- it's- it's really baity, but it, it's kinda cute. <laughs> Like, all the, like, shoutouts to any, like, independent, like, crafters who are trying to, like, make a business online. Like, I know it's difficult. Like, even getting people to, like, buy shit or check out your- Your page is difficult! Yeah, I agree, like- oh, Okay, that was stupid, that was stupid. My friend literally ate the bomb. I'm- I'm actually throwing it. I'm literally throwing it. Um... I think the way that TikTok lives work is like, even if you get like one or two reports on a stream, you get taken down. So I think that that like moderation is pretty good. So like, if you guys see anything that's like actually bad, like definitely report it. But if it's like baby, then it's like, eh, that's just how they run their content, you know? No, no, come on, no. Come on, I can, I can go back up to six. I can do it. I can do it. I still think it's surprising that I had, like, second twice this race. Like, I was doing pretty good. Yeah! Oh my god, stop gifting. You're distracting me. I think that stick is kind of funny. <gasps> no! No! Please! Fifth place! Okay. Okay. That was a roller coaster. That race was literally emotionally taxing on me. <laughs> We had no doubters? Come on, how can we have no doubters? You guys know this is online. You guys know I'm trashed online. How can we have no doubters? I mean, I appreciate that, but also... We need some doubters, at least. <laughs> yeah, I know. I agree, Patch. I'm trying... Okay, I'm at the point where, like, you know when you're bored? And like you open and you're like your social media and see there's nothing new like no po no new posts on your feed and then you just get sad that is me all day and I know it's toxic I know I need to change that behavior <laughs> see like I don't I think the most because like I think the whole point of TikTok is to where like you just like sit and like aimlessly scroll is is for a distraction right but I think the longest time that I've like scrolled is maybe thirty minutes. Like, I, I've never hit, like, the scrolling for an hour or two mark, thankfully. <laughs> I think because a lot of the time I scroll through TikTok muted. Because I know if I have the sound on, I'll get more distracted. So that's why, if you guys are going to be posting on TikTok, make sure you guys have, like, the automated captions or, like, have some types of captions on it. Like, if I see a video that doesn't have captions on it, I'll just, like, immediately swipe and, like, I need captions. Not that I don't- not that I, like, actually need captions for everything that I watch, but it's just, like, helpful. Yeah, I agree. Like, if you don't like the content or the creator, like, just, just, like, mute them or block them. Like, there's no need to, like, interact or give them shit. Cause, like, I'm very much, like, I, okay. Uh, I don't like inserting myself or, like, giving my opinion if it's not positive. Cause, like, the way I was raised, my mom, like, you know, you don't necessarily know how, like, other people will react. 
So it's important to like make sure you you're accountable and like make sure you're, you're acting appropriately. Yeah, exactly. If you don't like their shit, just don't interact or like mute or block. Like it's not that hard. Like, like I understand that people have the right to criticize, but also, in my head, you don't know how much like shit or hate someone's getting, right? So like, you may think that oh, I'm just one person leaving like this negative comment. But it's like, maybe that was the one thing that pushes them over the line, you know? And I, I mean like, a hateful comment in the sense of like... There, okay, there is a difference between criticism and then hateful. To me, criticism is like, pointing out... And like, taking note of someone's actions, right? But someone being hateful... Is like, someone commenting on like, something you can't change. So whether it be like, on your appearance, your ethnicity your identity. Like, that to me, if you're, like, commenting on that, like, that's hate. That's not criticism, that is hate. But if you are, like, commenting on someone's actions, that is criticism. Everyone has the right to criticize. Anyway, that's my take. That's my based Megan take. <laughs> I respect them for getting that bread. Okay, I think I agree. Like, I think people can farm as much as they want. And I know I personally like farming content a lot. I think it's funny. And like, there's always going to be people who are going to be willing to donate. Okay, self-report. If I'm in a stream, and the streamer says, Hey, can like can we get some gifted sub, guys? I, I will gift a sub. Because I think it's funny. I think it's funny. Because I think having a little bit of ego is fine. You know? I don't care. Like, people find it annoying, but I think it's funny. <laughs> Capitalism queen. <laughs> See, I love socialism, but also, why not make money if you can make money? You know, you know. I'm a pro progressive, but I'm probably like a dem sock. Now that I think about it, I... Dude, why not the DLC drag? Sad. Oh, chatters, chatters. I announced it at the beginning of the stream. But we are doing the tournament on Sunday, May 29th. Exclamation tourney and chat for more information. Fourth, I'm doing pretty good. <laughs> Keep forgetting to predict. You're fine, huh? I do too. Like, that's why I usually give, like, a verbal reminder too. Because, okay, I don't think the verbal reminder necessarily helps for, like, mobile viewers. Because <laughs> I think for mobile, there's probably, like, a solid, like, 10 to 20 second delay. Because I have, I have low latency mode on for stream. Meaning, I try and have like minimal delay, but I still think there's like a five second delay for like desktop viewers, which is fine. I think that's reasonable. So, like, in case anytime I like really fuck up, I can just end stream and I'll be safe. Dude, I'm in fucking last place. I'm in last place. Um, blue shell, let's go. <laughs> oh, I think another thing is, is like, since I have like the command that I'll put in chat as well, so like if someone sees like the, the Gamba command. Like, oh, it's time to predict. So usually if I'm doing something in chat that is, like, interactive, whether it be, like, a poll or prediction, I will have, like, a verbal reminder and then also, like, a reminder in chat. <sighs> okay, it's fine, it's fine. I can come back. Bullet! Okay, this is it, this is it. This is how I come back. Everybody's clustered right here. Everyone in the final four stars. It, it, it doesn't help at all.
Ninth, eighth. Dude, we sniped that guy from seventh place. That was kind of rude, but you know I needed a seventh. But damn, that's still that's still I lost. Feels bad, man. Dodge. I'm sure they understand. <laughs> no, they're probably like slamming their controller right now. <laughs> okay, new prediction is up, guys. Go place your bets. Yeah, there are so many people with stars at the end. I hate that. Like, the item distribution should be better. Like, it's no fun if everybody has a star. I don't feel special anymore. Everyone is super, no one is super. That sounds like a quote from the TV show Heroes. Or like something someone would say. Okay, does anyone genuinely like this track? I personally hate it. Because one, it's a track with cars on it. Obviously, it's not gonna be fun to undo the cars. Also, Having to navigate between these cliffs where you can't see around the corner is not fun. It is unfair. It is unsafe driving. We should not be traveling at this high velocity <laughs> where we cannot see ahead of us. It's from Incredibles? Oh. So, a, a hero movie. <laughs> so, I was kind of close. <laughs> but, oh my god, I was playing... I was watching Scootish and Stream yesterday, and he was doing lobbies with viewers. And I usually won't play it because, like, a lot of the people who play with him are, like, actually correct. But I got second in a race yesterday, and I was so happy. And it was during this track, and I was genuinely surprised. Because usually Scootish will have, like, a full lobby of 12 people. Because, you know, he's a partnered streamer now. Let's fucking go. But I got second, and I was so happy, because I usually get like a solid like 9th or 8th. This course is peak Mario Kart. Yeah! But it's still not fun! Fourth! Okay, come on, come on! Third, let's go, let's go. I've gotten a lot better at this turn at the end here, though. Like, oh wait, I don't think I've hit a single car this race. I'm getting better, imagine. Show? I knew it was gonna hit me. I knew it. Come on, please. I want to. I want at least top three. Top three. I can do it. I was holding top three for like a whole lap almost. Based course? No, this is a, this is a horrible course. How can anybody think this course is based? Guys, I dodged literally every single fireball in there. Top three, top three! Fourth. Fourth is good. I will take fourth. Fourth is fucking great on this track. Let's go! What do we have? What do we have? <gasps> Mac, you put doubt this time. <laughs> Let's go. I'm surprised I got top six. Like, honestly. Hey, DK Jungle, Avi. Hey, new prediction is up, guys. Go place your bets. Sag. <laughs> okay, guys, guys. How many points do you guys have so far in my chat? Because I was watching Hassan. Oh, he was playing Among Us. Okay. If you guys don't know, I watched a fuck ton of Hassan. So, I, I gambled 50,000 points that he would, um... Like, lose the game. And he lost. And I gained. So I gambled 50k, right? And I think the percentages was like 
60% believed he was gonna die, and then 40% believed he wasn't. I gained 40,000 points. So I was up 90k for that one prediction. I'm not saying go big or go home. But also, the more you gamble, the, the more you get in return, is what I'm saying. You're saving up? We got about- okay, so everybody's got about 5k. I know Nyx, that you- you spend your points a lot, so you- You know, you don't save them that much. You're saving up? Okay, okay. Oh, I need to make a command for the Twitter redemption. Cause I, I think it'd be cool if I could, like, link the, the tweet that I posted last for the predict- for the redemption, I mean. That way chatters will get an idea of what tweets they will see. <laughs> yeah, you're saving up for the Twitter draft? Yeah. <laughs> I feel like everybody is saving up for that one. I mean, I think it's definitely like one of the more fun rewards. Cause like everything else is pretty tame. Like nothing is too crazy. What we need, what we need is someone with like a lot of channel points to just like go all in on a prediction. And then you just get to steal all their points. That's all that needs to happen, guys. Hey, can I just say I'm distracted this race because my feet are uncomfortable? So that is why I keep throwing. That is why I keep throwing. You guys were watching earlier. I, I got like infinite first places earlier. comments like just in general saying how do you get like last place all the time <laughs> and in my head i'm like there's always gonna be someone getting first place and then always somebody getting last place and i'm usually the person in last <laughs> like i'm there in the back there to like make everyone else feel good about themselves Like, I'm the support. <laughs> <laughs> I hate green shells, I hate them so much. I've always, like, I've only, wait. Yeah, I don't think I've ever gone to a nail salon. It's like, I've never gotten, like, my nails done properly, but I would love to get a pedicure or a manicure. Like, I feel like they look like they're a little bit painful. But, like, I've seen, like, the little, like, basins where you put your feet in. And it has like water and shit, and then it kind of massages your feet. That looks like it feels good. Like I think I want to do that next year for my birthday. Sag, I got eighth. God damn it. Wildwood's obby. Hey, new prediction is up. Go place your bets, chat. Getting a manicure can be painful. See, like, okay. I think it was in ninth grade. My friend, her, um... <laughs> I think it's so cute when, like, little kids will, like, try and do, like, adult things. Like, you know how they, like, play kitchen, or, like, they paint, or they do nails, and it's so cute. Like, it's really good to encourage, like, those behaviors. But okay, I saw this one TikTok. I think it was like a preschool teacher and he was saying like, oh, the troubles of being a, a preschool teacher. And he was, his take was basically like, he's like, I know it's good to encourage people to do art. I know it's good to encourage people to draw. But also, I wish I could be honest and say that their artwork is bad. <laughs> I, I think it's so funny because like... Okay, when I was working at the daycare, like, I was, like, the person who drew, so, like, all the kids who, like, art, like, liked me, right? So they would hang out with me, and, like, I would teach them how to draw stuff. And, like, yes, I did encourage the kids, but, like, I wasn't mean about drawing, so I was like, oh, you know, that's cute, that's cute. But then I would also, like, show them techniques, like, simple stuff, like, like, how, like, choosing certain colors will, like, look good together, or, 
or like I would teach them like how to like color in with color pencils or crayons to like layer colors. Like just little things like that. The way like just teach them like basic art skills. And because like I think if you tell the kid like, oh it looks good, it looks good, but like if you don't like actually help them grow, then I don't know how much you're helping them. You know what I mean? Because like it's very easy to just say like, oh, I like your drawing. Like and just end it there. But I feel like if you encourage them further and like teach them little things. I think that'll help them in the long run. Because if you do take that extra step, like, you're showing that you're taking extra time and, like, willing to put effort into, like, their passions, right? I'm genuinely trying to focus right now because I, I need to catch up. I'm in solid 8th place. I can get back up to 6. Double item box. Let's go. Dodge the banana. Red shell. Got hit by the bomb. Right, let's go. Come on. Come on. Dude, I got 5th. I got 5th. Go. Oh, we didn't have any tatters. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. I'm doing pretty good today with online. I'm not. Wait, didn't I get one like dead last place? I'm doing fine. I'm doing fine. <laughs> I'm doing decent. Your new prediction is up. Go place your bets, chat. No one cares about <laughs> You're fine, we care, next we care. How much more you got for a school? Gotta go no problem, we'll see you later, Patch. I appreciate hanging out with us today for a little bit, but I hope you have a good one. How much longer you got till summer vacation? Cause like, I feel like everybody is stressing right now. Oh, just tomorrow? Dude, let's fucking go. You're right there, man. I feel like summer... Wait, I, I gotta start over. I gotta think about what I gotta say. Okay, I'll be honest. I'm trying to farm for a clip. I'm farming for a clip. <laughs> Self-reporting. Okay. <laughs> because, like, I'm the type to ramble, right? But then there's also like certain things where I need to like think about what I'm gonna say. Anyway, what was I gonna say? I was gonna. T it was, we're talking about summer. I feel like summer is one of those times of year where like most everyone is happy, right? Because like all the kiddos are out of school, you get to spend more time with your friends and your family. But I feel like a lot of people who, like, are in school or university, like, you lose that structure. So yes, you do have a lot of, like, free time to, like, go out and do stuff, right? But I feel like summer is the perfect length. Because I know when I was in elementary and, like, high school, like, summer was about three months long. But when I went to school in Hawaii, summer was only a month long. And I feel like a month was pretty solid. Because, like, I had enough time to go to the beach. I had enough time to hang out with my friends. But it wasn't to the point where, like, I felt like I was bored and had nothing to do. So I think a summer vacation in the States that's, like, two months long is pretty solid. I think that'd be great. Because, like, it's a long enough break to feel like you're actually gonna, like, have time to do stuff. To not feel bored. Okay, granted. Since I'm doing online college, I haven't had, like, a traditional summer break in a while. Because, like, the way that vacations work for me is that we get a week off. I think there was one year where I had like a month off from school and like that was fine. I can't remember if it was like three weeks or a month. Because like, I know when I was in school, like the summer vacation when it was like three months long, like back in elementary, like I was excited to go back to school. <laughs> like I was one of those dweebs. 
No, come on, come on. I want to get the ramp. Come on. There we go. Camp till August. Let's go. Dude, that was like a solid three months. Nice. Anybody got any plans for summer? Like, anybody gonna go on vacations? Or, like, any big events planned? I got 10th, rip. Pick your last final today? Let's go! Nice job, Mac. Going to Niagara Falls? That sounds like a good time. I've always wanted to see it in person. Going to Alaska in a month? Nice! That, sound, that does sound pretty fun. <laughs> hey, new prediction is up. Go place your bets, chat. I don't have necessarily anything planned. Because like I said, I don't get like month-long breaks. Kind of thing. Okay, the one thing I don't like about summer vacation is that since my mom works for the school, she also has three months off. So it's kind of like, you know when your parents are home all the time and it's just like super annoying. <laughs> love my parents, but also I don't want to see them all day, every day. You know what I mean? <laughs> yep, exactly. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like, it's nice for the first week. You know, mom gets to make you breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Okay, that's not all that she does, okay? I'm not- I'm not being sexist, okay? <laughs> But it's kind of like, you know when your parents are home and they're like, they make you do shit? And it's like, mom, this is technically my summer vacation too. Like, you can't just be telling me to do chores all day. Come on! Okay, what's kind of nice about, like, the increase of, like, technology, because, like, now my parents have, like, smartphones and iPads. Everyone kind of keeps to themselves. Because, like, naturally, like, everyone in the house is pretty introverted. So, like, everybody just kind of does their own thing. Which I think is fine. Because that way we're not, like, bugging each other all the time. Okay, what I do like about summer here in Washington is that it finally warms up. So, like, I can actually go outside and not have to wear a coat. Like, I can go out and wear, like, slippers, finally, and not freeze my toes off. <laughs> well, I'm excited for that. Hey, bullet saved. Second! Oh my god, I'm in second! Oh my god. The temperature goes up, what, 0.01%, but still, we feel it. I think it was either last year or the year before, right? like, Washington State had- No, I fell off, I fell off. I literally- Please, I had a solid fourth place. I had it. I had it. I'm grinning because Nyx, you're always so positive. And honestly, can I just say I'm really grateful I have wholesome chatters? Because imagine if my chat room was just shitting on me all day. I would video game myself. Like, I'm glad we have wholesome chatters. So I really appreciate it. So, like, thank you for clipping. I appreciate it. It's <laughs> oh. Because it's like. Yeah, I, I just got my card. <laughs> Exactly. But I think it's nice being able being able to like look over and see like positive chat messages. You know what I mean? 
New Gamba's up. Go place your bets, chat. Why did I choose Excite Bike? I literally was shitting on that track earlier. So, chatters, please stay wholesome. <laughs> please stay wholesome. <clears throat> I would cry all. Did like what? Wait, this is Miramud. What's nice about stream is that yes, I understand everyone has the right to like free speech, but also I'm the streamer, so I have the right to limit your free speech. But like, if someone is like shitting on me or like trolling a little too hard, I can time them up. I can delete a message. I can do whatever I want, right? Because like, I, I think the best explanation of it was essentially streamers see like streaming is like their safe place and chatters don't have a right to like violate your safe space so, like if someone's making you uncomfy or like you say something that's out of line like don't be afraid to like time out or delete that's why like if i don't like something i'll either like handle it quietly or like address it verbally if i don't like a message i see oh i think it's going also back on to what we talked about earlier where like if it's not positive then just don't say it but also have the understanding that yes people will like shit on you like that that's bound to happen for like anybody online oh that's cute that's really sweet of you to do nix like <laughs> when i'm playing with friends mind you like i i do trash talk a little bit but like i will always like try and say positive as well like, I don't- I'm not super mean. I will just trash talk, like, playfully. Like, just a l I will, like, be a little bit- not mean. I won't be mean. But, like, let's say, for example, I, like, intentionally snipe one of my friends in the chat, like, <laughs> got you, bitch! And then I'll, like, immediately revert back to, like, oh, you know, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> you know? Wait, I forgot there's only eight people in this lobby. I was like, god damn, I'm only an eight, that's pretty solid. But also, there's only eight people here. <laughs> Guys, I am so good at this game. Dude, I'm so far behind. Okay, I see them ahead of me. Bullet Bill, Bullet Bill! <gasps> ah, eighth place! God damn it, I could have gotten sixth. This track, yeah, this tr track is actual god dog shit. I hate this track. See, blame the game, not the player, guys. Okay, I think I will do two more games. We'll do two more games. It, it's wild to me. Like, yeah, then Animal Crossing, let's fucking go. Um, it's wild to me to think that it's already been nearly two hours with you guys. I go wash my dog, okay? That's random, but <laughs> have fun with that, I guess. But we'll, we'll see you in a bit. <laughs> yeah, it's wild, isn't it, hun? Because, like, I remember. Yeah, we're not there yet. We're not there yet. Two more games, two more games. <laughs> Okay, chatters, chatters. If you are regulars, I would love if you guys, like, baited me into the ad break. Why is my head not working? Oh. My headset isn't working now. No! Okay, I'll fix that during the ad break. Dude, I'm playing Mario Kart muted right now. I know you guys can still hear it, thank god. But my headset just shit itself. Okay, I use Raycons. I love Raycon. And the reason why I love Raycon is because my favorite YouTuber told me to buy it. <laughs> but I think the headsets are pretty good. I like the over-the-ear ones because like the memory phone is pretty nice. But the earbuds, for some reason, 
they always like break after a while. I think because like with the earbuds you just handle them more in general. It's, like it's very easy to like break the, me the mechanisms and like also if you drop them, there's just GG's, right? But for some reason, like both of my headsets, like this one just went out. Like now it's playing super soft, like I can... That was unfair. You guys see that the red shell hit the fucking banana. <laughs> anyway. So like essentially like, even if I have the volume on at full max, I still think it's only playing at like 1%. So probably like something internally was wrong. And I just got these headsets I think four months ago. And I don't use them that often. I usually just use them for stream. Because once I got the over the ear ones, like, I don't like earbuds as much. Like, I never found, like, earbuds that comfy because, like, just the idea of having something in my ear is kind of weird. No! Come on! I had a boombox! If you get a pair with warranty, true. Because, like, I, I'm trying to think. I usually don't buy warranty in anything. Like, even when I bought my laptop, I was like, you know, if I break it, it's my fault. You know? Because I'm like, I don't want to cough up an extra 25 bucks if I'm not really going to use it. Like, I don't, okay, warranty is different from insurance. Because, like, you you definitely need, like, health insurance, car insurance. Because, like, that's so, more something more severe. Because, like, if you, if you fucking die, okay, not if you die. <laughs> but if you get hurt, like, that could be, like, thousands and thousands of, like, medical bills, right? But, like, if I'm going to put, like, a $25 warranty on, like, a $50 pair of headsets, I'm like, is it really worth? I don't know. And, like, the warranty is, like, half the cost of the headset. I'm like, uh, It's hard for me. Okay. Because, like, they promote it when you check out, right? Dude, I got fucking bid. Let's go. Top six. Let's go, baby. Wait, I didn't do a prediction. Oh. Damn. Does this one work? No, this headset doesn't work either. Damn. <clears throat> Will they connect now? Oh, oh, oh! God! Please work. DK Jungle, Abby. Connect, connect, come on, please work, please work. It's so cringe playing the game muted. Yeah, th this earbud is fucked. It's fucked. Okay, so... My left earbud is, is busted. It's playing at 0% now. And then now my right earbud that was already broken... Is playing at, like, 5%. God damn it. Ooh, I could just increase the volume. Five <laughs> Dude, I'm so fucking stupid. I... Okay, because, like, the way I have my, like, headset set up is I have my Bluetooth headsets connected to my Samsung TV. Prediction! They go Gamma Chat. So, essentially, I can't change the volume by, like, tapping my headset. I have to change it by, like, increasing the TV volume. Okay, we're fixed. I can hear Mario Kart now. But now we know left headset is now broken. Yeah, I agree. I should have gotten a warranty on my laptop looking back on it, but like she hasn't broken yet and it's been I think eight months. So I think I'm good. I think I'm fine. Dang that sucks, yeah. Should I make my new do a new donagle, like new headsets? Because I think I need a new headset before a new controller, honestly. I mean, it's fine, because, like, I could connect my, like, my other headsets to the TV, but yes, my, like, headsets are comfy, but I don't think I can wear them for three hours straight, because, like, they get uncomfy after a while. Because, like, I have a big head. I have a five head. My brain is so big that not all headsets can fit it. So it's, it's hard to, like, find a pair that fits well. Like, even my glasses, the frames are men's frames. Because I just have a wider head. <laughs> we thought it was part of the movie! I mean, that's a pretty good gag, like... 
I think that would be like a college art piece where you just walk into the student film theater and it's just the movie on mute. Or I guess that would be a silent film, I guess, right? <laughs> yeah, and like, I haven't bought myself a nice pair of headsets in a while because I think the pair that I bought previous to this pair of like headsets, I think I bought when I was in like 10th grade. Guys, I'm in first! The guy's a red shell! I'm gonna get fucked! Save? Nope. Give a red shell! Come on! Come on! I literally had first. I had it. I had it for once in my goddamn life. I had first. I was gonna say this is the last race, but we can do one more. I need to redeem myself. Top six, come on, come on. Easy. You say six is great, but DCP, she's literally crying her eyes out right now. <laughs> okay, we'll do one more race. One more race. Hi, Q. Welcome to stream. Hope we're doing well today. Um, exclamation rules to get a brief overview of what we are doing. I hope you're doing well today, man. Um, what was I saying? Headsets. Tell her to suck it up. <laughs> yeah, Peach needs to fucking get good Animal Crossing, I'll be Do a prediction. But let's, let's look at my headsets real quick while we're waiting. Like, not sponsored. If I ever will take a sponsor, I will gladly be take Raycon. But what's nice is that yes, the pads are memory foam, but like, wait, can you see that? But this part, it kind of like rotates. And then also like this stretches out. These headsets are so nice. I love them so much. They were like $80 though. And I was scared because I didn't want to go to the store and try headsets on because, okay. You know, when you go to like GameStop and they have the control out and you get to play with the game how often do you think they clean those and like how do you even clean like a pair of headsets that are on display like just, just picture how many people have tried it on right <coughs> makes me want to yak so like i didn't want to go to the store and try headsets on so like when i ordered those online i was like crossing my fingers i don't pray but i prayed that they would fit <laughs> but thankfully they fit really nicely Oh, it was a W. I made a good purchase. Okay, this is our last race of the day. Last prediction of the day, guys. Wait, it's already closed. I was gonna say place your bets, but it's too late. plus size as well it's very difficult to find clothing online that fits because like my body type i've said it before like i i'm technically like an xl or a zero zero or a size zero xl not zero zero dude no shot am i a zero <laughs> or i'm a zero xl <laughs> and it's hard to find clothes that fit me well because i'm also very short and i like uh, what's a nice way of saying it? I don't have a big chest, so like, a lot of the stuff that's really like, plus size, like, the chest is usually bigger, and it's very hard to find shit that fits. And like, I haven't gone clothes shopping IRL in nearly, like, a year and a half. Because like, one, I don't have the need or desire to buy new clothes. Oh wait, no, I do want to buy new clothes. I want to, I just don't have money. Come on. Um, we clapped them, easy. Top three, baby, top three. We've been in top three this whole lap. Let's fucking go. But just in general, it's very hard to, like, find stuff that fits me well. I want to, like, learn how to sew and, like, tailor stuff. Or, like, maybe make my own clothes. I think that would be really fun to try. But also, like, making stuff on your own. And just, like, crafting in general. Do we geometry that bitch! Okay. <laughs> but it's also just really expensive to, like, buy fabric and materials. Like, it's crazy how expensive it is. Yeah, I agree. It's so useful. Like, my mom, she knows how to tailor and sew. Like, she's tried to teach me, but I, I just cannot do it. Like, my brain does not understand how it all works. <laughs> Second! 
Second, please. No, no, I knew they had a boomerang. Top three, top three. Top three. Please, I can hold. They stole the boomerang. Just get first. Just attack first, please. You don't need to get me. Dodge the man. We have full protection. They hit a wall. Guys, I got second in an online match. This is crazy. This, this, this like never happens. Guys, I got fucking second place. I am so happy. I am genuinely so happy right now. This never happens. On our last race of the day, our last race. Guys, nobody participated in the prediction. Okay, let, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Dude, that is insane. Yeah, I'm the <laughs> queen of crap. <laughs> that is insane. How did I clutch and get a second? That is crazy. <laughs> but yes, Nyx, you are correct. We are another hour into stream, and it is time to fulfill my contractual obligation to run an ad break. So, you can avoid the ad break by subscribing for just $4.99, just $5 a month. Skip your coffee today and get ad previewing all month long. Or link your Amazon Prime account to your Twitch account and get a free Amazon Prime sub every month. It is literally free. Do it right now. Give it to me, please. <laughs> anyway, you're not going to be missing much. I have to change out my game cartridge because we're going to switch gears to Animal Crossing. If you're new to stream, how Animal Crossing works is it's more just chatting. We do our dailies. Oh, we had a lot of shit happen over the weekend. So we're going to talk about that. Um, So, <clears throat> yeah, we will see some of you guys in a few. Or Oilers, Oilers. Now is the time to give subs so people can avoid the ad break. But anyway, see some of you guys in a few. <sighs> yeah, I need to catch up on Heartstopper. I think I'm like halfway through it. But like my usual like manga reading time is past my bedtime. So I haven't had time to like read or watch anything. Like, I'm literally so far behind on my YouTube subscriptions. I'm, like, a solid week behind on videos. And it makes me sad to think about. Okay. Okay, everybody stretch. Oh, my legs, my knees. I'm getting old. I'm running out of them, Sag. <laughs> Same. Okay. What? Should we change our title? Okay, we can get rid of the rules command. Because we're not doing stakes for Animal Crossing. Chat is literally making me lose. Are you winning, son? Kind of. I did win the last fucking race. I'm still like super hyped and excited about that. I still, I got a second, which is crazy. If any, any regulars know, I fucking eat shit every Mario Kart race, but I got a fucking second. I think we can keep the title the same for now. Meg is always winning. <laughs> literally, literally. Um. Chat is literally making me- I, I think we can keep the title the same. I think- I think it's fine. Wait. Chat? <laughs> Bring in that pink. Okay, I- I think I might have a good title. I might have a good title. Is this a good title? Thoughts, chat? As I said earlier, if you're new to stream, we usually just do chatting. You know, get to know each other, do our dailies. Oh, I had a lot of shit happen over the weekend. You will see it in the introduction. Partially about what happened. If you want to see, like, extra shit about stream, because I usually leak stuff before the live, go follow my Twitter. You will get not occasional go-live notifications. You'll get funny shit. 
I don't spam too much, mind you. Okay. Everybody get ready, get comfy. <clears throat> Hello there, everyone. Right now in Timbaland, it is 12.51 p.m. on Tuesday, May 17th, 2022. Oh! Today is also Gail's birthday. How wonderful. Happy birthday! Yeah, can we get some feels? <laughs> Wait. Feels birthday, man? There we go. <laughs> for Gail. <laughs> okay. Now for additional announcements. Oh, here comes the sad news. Tomorrow, Tiblin bids a fond farewell to our dear friend Plucky. It's hard to say goodbye, but we wish her luck on our next big adventure. There we go. Audio's fixed. I had to lower it a little bit. <clears throat> okay. Be sure to stop by for one last chat before she leaves. Maybe bring some tissues. That's all for today. Have a fun day out there. Aurora confirmed. I wish. I wish. If Okay. If you follow my Twitter, you know already. Literally, the other day, I have become good friends with Plucky. She calls me backbeat now. But yesterday, she comes up to me and says, Hey, I want to leave. And I know if we're on stream and a villager wants to leave, we'll run a poll. But I said, if I offline have a villager who wants to leave, I will let them go. If you love them, let them go. Right? So Plucky is leaving. Sag. Oh, okay. Also, I rearranged my island a little bit. A little... A teensy bit. As you can... As you guys remember, I had flowers here. And then... Flowers here. But I think what I want to do for the island now, because like, I know I said I'm actually going to start decorating now, because we're grinding for KK now. So, I just realized I can't point. <laughs> um, okay, so essentially I want all of my buildings in like the bottom right corner on like that part of the island. And then I want like the midsection to be like flowers, crops, and trees. And then the upper section, I don't know why I'm pointing. <laughs> and then I want the upper section, like, the light green areas to be, like, um, like a sanctuary. So we'll have, like, animal statues, like a garden, essentially. So I started working on that last night. Yeah, I agree. I bought this fit the other day and I love it so much. I feel like the dress is kind of simple, but it's cute, you know? Okay, so I put all my flowers here. So we're gonna have a flower field here. As you can the house used to be there. That's why there's that big green square. Because I have to wait. I had to wait till today to move this house. Um, and then here, once we rearrange a bit, I'll have the crops. And then I also have to move these houses to like the bottom right. Uh, so that's the plan for now. I'll usually do it offline. But yeah, that, that's that's all that's new essentially. Very organized. <laughs> it, well, we're getting there. We're getting there. <laughs> oh, also, okay. I was annoyed at my sister because she she doesn't play. She only plays when her friend wants to play with her, and they just run around the island like fucking my shit up. So I went to my sister's account to like get some items, and she had all of these flowers in her inventory. So I had to plant them. So I have to. Ooh, we got a purple one. How did how did we get a purple one? That was not there yesterday. I literally had just yellows. How do two yellows make a purple? I don't know. That's kind of weird. Um, so I'll be like redecorating more offline gradually, not every day, mind you, because it's gonna take a while to like rearrange the houses. But that's the plan. That's my new plan. I also need to buy more furniture. That looks cute. Oh, I, I prepped my inventory for stream. Imagine. Oh, we need to get a present for Gail. flowers are popping up. What does the beautiful island do, exactly? Because I usually will do the one that, like, like, the capitalism one, where, like, items sell for a lot more. I usually choose that ordinance. Alright, I smell bacon right now. And it smells so fucking good. Because last night, for dinner, 
Um, we essentially made grilled cheese sandwiches, but with bacon, and it was so fucking good. Like, um, what do you call it? What do you call it? What do you call when you put it in the oven and it only heats from the top? What is it called? I know what it's called. It's not toasting. It's not roasting. No, it's not poached. I know what it is. I know what it is. It's not brown. I know what it is. I know what it is. What is it? Broil, broil. We broiled some bread. And then we made grilled cheese. But I, bro I broiled. Broiled is a really weird word to say. I broiled some garlic bread. And then we made grilled cheese with bacon in it. And guys, the way to make perfect bacon is in the air fryer. Try it. You will never go back. Yeah, broiled. Yeah, it's- it's- I cannot say it. I say some words funny sometimes. What should we get for Gail? Ooh. Maybe? Okay, I think... Gail is the... the alligator, I think, right? <gasps> okay, I usually don't give my animals, like, actual presents. Like, I usually just give them fruit. But wouldn't these carnations be perfect for Gale? Can I get- I know that was like a special, like, limited item. Hopefully I can buy more. If not, I'm gonna cry. But you know, I don't need to. We can give one to Gale. I think this is Gale's house. Oh, we're really perfectly dressed up for Gale too. Because I think Gale is like fully pink. Yeah, that is Gail's house. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna give her the best present ever. Hey, welcome. Please come on in. in it. <laughs> Please come on in and join us, Megan. Badge. Plucky would be here. Because Plucky was, I think, Gail's best friend. But, you know, Plucky is leaving us. <laughs> it's so flattering to have visitors on my birthday. And I'm really touched that some friends had gifts for me. Dude, literally all the villagers are so ego whenever you give them a gift. They're like, hey, I know you brought me a gift, right? It, it's so annoying. I brought this for you, Gail. Oh, for me? Really? This is so exciting! Yeah, you totally knew I brought a gift! Fucking bitch! <laughs> oh, this is so sweet! You got me some carnations! I will treasure this! Your gift made me so happy! Thank you so much! Yeah, Peggy annoying as fuck. I used to have Peggy on my old island. I hated her. <laughs> Way to be here! I was hoping you'd show up! Today's Gail's day! Let's make this a party to remember! Okay, I'm out. <laughs> Aw. Time for you to leave? I hate to see you go. I just have to say again. That gift you brought really made me happy. Sag. See, you know the cool people leave the party early. Am I right, guys? Fist bump. <laughs> yeah, that bit was so fucking stupid. Uh, who's leaving? Plucky. We gotta talk to Plucky, Sag. Dude, I can't believe Plucky is leaving us. I think she disposed of my old villager. Um. <laughs> I can't prove it. That's a little sus. <laughs> uh, Sag Plucky. Oh, they call me Backbeat. That's it. Like, literally, Plucky just gave me a nickname and now she wants to fucking leave. Hey, Backbeat, thanks for stopping by. So, if the boxes don't make it obvious, I'm moving out. Yeah, I fucking know. You asked me yesterday. I gotta thank you for your advice the other day. It really helped me get my head straight. Thanks. I'm so glad we got to party together. I hope we're able to rock again someday. Stay awesome, alright? Badge. Yeah, you're right. Hopefully we get a good villager. Hopefully we get Aurora. 
Because, like, I wish the plots would stay empty until you had someone intentionally move in. Like, I hate when just Tom Nook is like, hey, I'm bringing my own immigrants in. Like, <laughs> oh no, oh no. Let's not, let's not go down this path. But I want to choose who moves into my town, okay? <laughs> let me, let me clarify. I'm a progressive. I don't, I love immigration. It, it's jokes. Leftism is no jokes, I know, but I am making a joke. Okay. I want to check the price for turnips first. Because I think I purchased them for $95 on Sunday. $300! Fuck me. Dude, we're down 10%, guys. Our stonks are not looking good. It's gonna say crypto, am I right? But... Okay, I, I'm not into crypto. I don't have money to invest. I don't have any regular investments. So... I know everyone is clowning on cryptocurrency, like how the market is crashing right now. Oh, it does tell me the turnip prices, really? So I can officially watch. Let's go. Hi, welcome back to Stream Mac. Hope you're doing well. Um, I know everyone like is clowning on the crypto bros, but honestly, I feel bad for the people who invested when they had no money or who invested like their whole savings account when they were already poor. Feels bad, man. Like, it's not that I don't care about the rich people who lost money. Like, I feel bad for the normal person. You know. I said I had like a paper with topics on it and my topics are literally <laughs> joke about crypto and talk about taking melatonin gummies. That's what my notes say. <laughs> Any walks yet? No, not yet. Not yet. Oh, the other day I was playing offline. Okay, I assume since it's almost summertime in game, like the wasps will spawn more. And I literally got six beehives, and I caught all six of them. I wanted to screen record it, but as you guys know, for, like, Switch, it only screen records the past 30 seconds. So I couldn't record, like, 10 minutes straight of footage, unless I was, like, screen capping on my computer. But I promise you, I am not lying, I caught six wasps all in a row in one day. Like, I, I was feeling on top of the moon that day. It was crazy. I was so fucking good. Okay, because I think I've mastered the strategy now. I say that, but I still mess it up sometimes. I think... I will demonstrate it later if we have, like, a chance. Yeah, I think my strategy is actually the way to go. I think Nick's... I think last week said they actually tried it and it works. I think it depends on what side of the tree you're on as well. Because usually the bees will fly, like, clockwise. But sometimes, if you're standing on the left side of the tree, they will fly counterclockwise. And that affects the direction they will fly towards you. So I think we will see that, like, if we actually do get a beehive today. Which we most likely will. Now 100% confirmed. At least it was one day 100%. I'm getting better, though. I think, okay, offline, I do it almost every time. Like, I don't often get stung offline. But when I stream, you guys know it's distracting. Like, there's like 10 times the amount of pressure as there would be when you know that people are watching you play, you know? <laughs> okay, the reason why I mentioned that I'm out of topics, uh, I'm, I'm gonna go grab my question book in a second. <laughs> Because, like, the big reason why I have the question book is, like, so I can get used to, like, 
thinking of like responses on the fly because I think like what's really important for streaming just in general is like being able to like play off of what chat is saying and also like having a somewhat like constructive like not constructive but like co cohesive that's the word cohesive like conversation so that way let's say for example people are watching clips or watching back of VOD they like can understand what you're talking about because I think it's important to like to be able to like expand off of what chat is saying um so like if I see a chat message I should be able to like continue that conversation and go off a tangents for at least like two minutes essentially is what I'm trying to work on next plan games for stream um I don't know <laughs> I kind of want to stick with more Mario. Like, I think we talked about it last week, but I think the next Mario game will do. Because I, I kind of want to stick with the, um, every game over, I guess, subs run. I think that's a really fun, like, concept for stream. So I think we'll stick with that idea. I think, okay, I have to play a game that's ported to the Switch. Because I can't do an emulated game. Mario Galaxy, yeah, that's what we were talking about. So we're probably going to do Mario Galaxy next. Um. Because, like, I can't do an emulated game. Because since I only stream from my laptop, I don't have a dual monitor. It would be very difficult for me to like moderate the chat room and like run predictions if I'm doing everything from one monitor. So I have to play a game that's ported to the Switch. Um, so probably Mario Galaxy is the next Mario game. But honestly, honestly, it's gonna take a long ass time before we finish Kirby. So I was thinking like maybe a Yoshi game. Why did you hook up the laptop to the TV? Okay, wait, let me think about that, let me think. But would I be able to use my controller? Because I hate playing keyboard and mouse, I can't do it, my brain can't handle it. So if I can't- there's probably a way to like... Have it where it'll take your controller inputs. It probably would take some hacker mans, right? <laughs> See, I like to say I'm decent with tech, but I'm not a pro, you know, I'm not a hacker. Do I have hacker mans? I think I have. Yeah, I do have hacker mans enabled. <laughs> Sorry, I I'm literally such a chatter. Like, in my normal speech too, I just think of like what would be the closest like emote equivalent to what I'm saying. What do you do for your setup, Mac? I'll have to look into it. I say that, but then I won't. But <laughs> one day I'll, like, look into it for real. I think maybe, maybe I can try a Pokemon game. I can try. Because Arceus looks pretty good. So maybe that's what we'll do after Kirby. Is there another Kirby game ported to the Switch? If there is, then we'll probably do that game next. It's not that hard, Omega Lol. Probably. <laughs> it's just the idea of doing things, like, stresses me out. You don't know how fun it is? Well, I will make it fun. <laughs> okay, safe so to do like HDMI, okay. Because like, mm, another concern I have with like, um, like PC gaming while I'm streaming is I don't know if my computer can handle it because right now, Wait, 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 you guys see that? Okay, as y'all know, a few weeks ago, I rearranged my flowers to see if they would cross-pollinate, but look! Look at that, I got a blue hyacinth. 
like my laptop is pretty good. Oh. You guys saw that it dropped for a second, didn't it? It did, didn't she? Proving my point exactly. Like the Alienware, she's great, she's amazing. But if I was to do like PC like gaming, <laughs> yes, it did drop Sedge. Yeah, see, like if I were to do like a PC game and stream it, I would only be able to stream at 480p, which I ain't doing. I'm not streaming at 480p because like yeah, I agree. It could be the capture card because um, I have a capture card for my Switch and then a capture card for my camera. So, and like, in my head, I want to make sure I have the best quality stream in terms of like visuals, because um, since a lot of my content is cross-posted to like TikTok or YouTube, um, people expect like higher quality resolution on those platforms. Yeah, it, it is a lot of CPUs. Like, what's she at? She's at 28% now, right now. Um, so maybe... Just the idea of doing test streams is stressing me out right now. But you know, it's fine. I need to stop complaining. I will... I will PC game at some point. I will do it. Just not... not anytime soon, probably. But why am I getting my fishing rod? Because <laughs> I think my dream setup... Because, like, I like playing off of my TV. Like, I like having the big screen, it makes me feel cool. But the dream setup would be to have a second TV or like a monitor right next to my TV and have the chat room feed to that. That way I don't have to look at my computer. Because right, my setup right now, my TV is here and my camera is here. So I feel bad all the time because I don't necessarily look at the camera when I'm talking in chat. Like, it definitely feels like I'm disassociating a little bit. But like, if I had my like TV monitor right here, like POV Megan, right here behind my camera. Then when I'm looking at chat, I'm looking at the camera. Wouldn't that be cool? Maybe I could see if my dad can help me get like a cheapy monitor at some point. But that would be the dream setup. Cause like you ever see like the like the streamer setups and they have like four or five monitors? Like that's insane to me. Like that's prob oh. Damn it, I fucked up. I messed up. <laughs> okay, the thing I was going to mention was okay, I think the wasps. I don't remember which way they flew, but what I've noticed offline is that when they fly like counterclockwise, they kind of. So when they're spinning this way, right? They'll kind of like turn around and fly around your head behind you, and that's when you can catch them with a net. 66? Yeah, exactly. I fell off. <laughs> um. So I still have to find the pattern. Yeah, but anyway, the people with like a million and one monitors, I feel like that's just triggering the fuck out of their ADD. Like, I like being able to look at my one screen and, like, everything is there. Like, I don't care if I have, like, too many tabs open. Like, that's manageable. Oh, I was so annoyed yesterday. Like, I had just finished watering all my flowers. And then it started raining. And I was like, I just spent ten minutes watering all my flowers. And then it rains. Yeah, I agree. I think two monitors is, like, the max I would ever do. Because, like, ideally, I would like to have, like, chat bigger. Because right now, my setup, I have, um, a tab for Twitch Studio. Taking up half my screen. And then the other half of my screen is mod view. That way I can see a live feed of my stream. I can see, like, moderation tools. I can see the actual chat room. Oh! Again! I didn't do fast enough! No! We're at a 0% win streak right now. <laughs> I promise, guys. I know what I'm doing. I'm, I'm still riding off the high of Mario Kart. 
I think that's how it goes. If I just take W's in Mario Kart, then I just take L's in Animal Crossing. I think that's fair. Anyway, so I have half my screen for my actual broadcasting software, and then the other half for like Twitch chat. I wish I could make the chat bigger in a sense of like, like make the font bigger. But since the chat is like integrated into Twitch Studio, I can't necessarily make it bigger. Which is fine, it's fine. Wait, I forgot to water my flowers, didn't I? Oh well. Chatterino. Yes, I did look into Chatterino. But the issue with Chatterino, from what I- Yeah, it is called Chatterino. From what I noticed is that, um, for moderation, you can type in, like, slash commands. So, like, slash, like, commercial if you want to run an ad, slash, like, sub if you want to run a sub-only chat, like, quickly. But Chatterino does not support the slash commands, and since I'm only working from, like, one monitor, it's a lot easier to type in commands than, like, open up, like, a pop-up window for predictions, for example. So, I would consider Chatterino, but it's just not ideal for my setup right now, unfortunately. So, I like the UI of Chatterino a lot, though. Like, being able to, like, pull up links and, like, have a preview of the link. Or, like, being able to, like, pull up logs or, like, time out people easily is definitely a- <gasps> Those are purple pansies. I wasn't even trying to get purple pansies up here. Oh my god. Sorry, that's crazy, that's crazy. See, I don't even try and I get rare flowers. How, how does this happen? It's definitely a great idea that I formatted my flowers like this up top. Because, like, no, I don't water them every day because that would be actually insanity. But I still got... Look, we got a blue and... We got a blue hyacinth and... A purple pansy today. Really? I didn't know that about the flowers. Because, like, when I was playing Animal Crossing when it first came out, I didn't have, like, any friends who played the game. So I wasn't able to, like, pick up patterns on those type of things. Sag. <laughs> Dude, today's been a great day. We got a second in online. I got purple pansies. Dude, literally best day ever. Better than my fucking birthday. <laughs> Uh, and we got gold. Oh my god. Is today a lucky day? Is that what it is? Is that what's going on? Okay, let's go back. Drop some shit off. I know once it's time to clear out this area, it's gonna be hell. Like, re-digging up all these flowers again. Not gonna be fun. But, you know, I think for now it's worth. Because I think I'm only gonna start working on this area, like, actually decorating in maybe a few weeks. So, it's something I can definitely put on the back burner. You know what I mean? <gasps> oh my god! Thank you, Anonymous, for the $5 donation. I appreciate it. I don't know who you are, but thank you. I appreciate it. I really do. Anonymous, you're gonna get your name right in the end of stream. <laughs> this is literally winner's POV. <laughs> Actually, it is. Today, I'm just taking W after W. Oh my god. Wait, guys, did the alert show up for the donation? Did anybody catch that? I don't know how to add- Was that you, Rainy? Oh, you're so cute. <laughs> but I appreciate it. Was it you, hon? If it was, I'll, I'll write your name at industry. if it was. <laughs> Either way, I appreciate it. 
Oh, was you? Okay, cool. We'll write your name, Rainy. Oh, well, hi, Rainy. Welcome to stream. Hope you're doing well today. Sorry, I forgot. <laughs> Hope you're doing well today, hon. Your stream yesterday was really fun. But you stayed for a long ass time last night, didn't you? You're actually insane. <laughs> Cause like I would have stayed for like the Valorant part, but honestly I can't watch any FPS games. Like they make me wanna yak. Dude, what if I like became an FPS streamer? Dude, that'd be so fucking boring. Honestly. Because I feel like FPS streamers, I think you have to be good at the game. Because like for- I'd leave. <laughs> Honestly, I wouldn't judge you. I would not watch an FPS streamer either. Because like- um, For like FPS games, you have to concentrate. Like. You cannot afford to spend, like, a second to, like, glance at chat, usually, right? So I feel like chat culture for S F FPS games are not there. Because, like, I think it's fine to, like, mess up in Mario Kart, because, like, you're obviously going to take L's anyway from, like, items or, like, other people playing. But, like, in FPS games, I feel like the community is also really aggro, too. So I think it would be different if I started playing, like, FPS when I was, like, a little. And like naive, but I don't think I want to play as an adult. Okay, I want to try Fortnite. I would be down to try Fortnite at some point. Oh, that's cute. I'm glad you had a good time, Rainy. I'm really glad. Like, I know a lot of like voice chats chats are like typically toxic but like sometimes you get nice people like i think it was a few months ago but i was playing um what was i was playing mario Kart with my sister and we had like the voice chat that nintendo has that's really cringe that like literally no one uses but there was this one girl who was rping as oh i don't know the actress's name but you know the the dancer in um I can't remember the name. But you like, you know the little girl dancer who's in the music videos for that one singer? The chandelier song, the chandelier song. That that artist, that artist. Like she was RPing as that girl, the dancer, and it was like so fucking stupid. But the person like committed to the joke and the bit and it was so fucking funny. Yeah, Maddie Z, that's the person. That was it. So they, they were RPing as Maddie Z. They were like, yeah, I'm literally her. And I'm like, bet, sure. <laughs> and like, it was so stupid, but so funny. And like, we were in, cause like we added them as a friend afterwards. And like, we were just playing Mario Kart for like two hours straight. Like, and she was RPing the whole time. I mean, it was weird, but it's so funny. <laughs> cause cause it, it's such a stupid joke. But me and my sister were just laughing our asses off the whole time. I can never hold a bit for that long, me neither. That that's why me and my sister were like still in like the voice chat with her to see if she would crack. And like she actually cracked after like an hour and a half. Because we, we kept asking her like every five minutes, are you are you lying? Like, are you actually are you actually this person? What? I didn't grab the net. I didn't grab the net. I messed up. That that'll be my new um title. I messed up. <laughs> like the cliche clickbait YouTube title.
Yeah, the only demerit to having the flowers like this is that I can't dash through them. Like, that is obviously a negative. I mean, it wouldn't really matter because the flowers grew back pretty quickly, but... I don't know, I'm on the fence. Because these flowers do have potential. We did get a purple pansy and a blue hyacinth today. Okay, I took off the glasses for my character because I felt like the glasses weren't fitting for my Princess Peach fit. But it's kind of sad seeing her all swollen and beaten up. <laughs> like, feels bad, man. Like, she is struggling right now. Yeah, I'm usually dashing the whole time. And I don't even realize that I'm dashing. Like, even here, it's like, what? One, two, three, four steps, and I'm still, like, running. So I have to be running the whole time. counterclockwise that time and then when I retrieved my net and they saw me they changed their direction TLDR I find that I'm more likely to catch the wasps if I'm hitting the tree from the right side because the bees will automatically fly clockwise hi patch welcome back to stream hope you're doing well man yeah but not the bees <laughs> that is the pattern that I noticed so if you hit the tree from the left side they will fly counterclockwise and more likely like loop back around to change direction. When in comparison, when you hit them from or when you hit the tree from the right side, it's more likely to start with clockwise. This <laughs> dropped down to 15% success rate. Wait, did I catch one today? I didn't catch any today. God damn. So technically it's at 0% today. Sag. Okay, we should get a few more because we've already gotten three. We'll probably get like two or three more. So I can I, I, so oh I cannot talk so I can explain it a little bit further. Yeah, I don't know about you guys, but I like to look for patterns and things. So when I'm out and about, like, I'll, like, look at the sidewalk and, like, notice if there's any patterns between, like, altering, like, grooves in the cement. Or, like, I'll try and notice patterns between, like, buildings or, like, bike racks. I feel like that's a little bit weird. <laughs> like, I know a lot of people just, like, go through their daily lives, like, just, like, living and not, like, observing things. Like, as I was on my bike ride this morning, like, I was- Okay, I was looking at the road, mind you. But, like, I was also looking at, like, the different, like, street poles. Because, like, I noticed, like, not every other, but, like, every second street pole is a metal one instead of a wood one. So, like, I was thinking about it. I was like, am I weird for, like, noticing, like, little shit that doesn't really matter? Okay, I know it's not a weird thing to do, but it's just like... It was weird for me to think about like... How people... Don't like... Observe that much. I don't know. I think you're just observant, probably. <laughs> or I'm special, I don't know. <laughs> Cause my sister does it too. Like if we're sitting in the car together in the back seat, We'll like look for patterns as we're looking out the window. And like we'll talk to each other after the ride, be like, hey, did you notice that? Oh, you know what's my favorite thing to like look for in public? Is like the little like stickers that people will put. Not like 
like spray paint, but like you know how people put like stickers on like signs or like poles. Like I think it's cool to see like the same sticker everywhere. Okay. Okay, the bees are flying. Okay, see how they turned around? Did you guys see that? So the bees initially went counterclockwise, right? And then as I was waiting for my net, they changed direction to clockwise. And then they looped around before that change. So as I was looping around and changing direction, that's when I should catch the bees. That's how you should time it. That's the pattern I noticed. Anyway, that's a Animal Crossing tips with Megan. <laughs> Wait for the bees to change direction and then retrieve your net. What percent now? One out of five, so 20. <laughs> PhD in wasp. <laughs> yeah, so I got a one out of five today. I got a 20%. That is a solid F. I failed today. But you know, we still got a second of Mario Kart. That's pretty pog. I'm, I'm still riding off that high. <clears throat> I'm talking really loud today and I don't know what it is. Like, I'm looking at my audio levels and I'm like, dude, I'm talking fucking loud right now. Okay. You big fish? Really? Really did the- <laughs> Please, don't do this to me. There we go, easy. All that work for a stupid tire? Fucking trash? <laughs> Never mind that day. <laughs> no, today's been good. Once again, I appreciate anybody who gifted or donated. I really do. Also, today was just fucking good, like, game-wise. Honestly. <laughs> it has been a good one. Okay, I know it's cliche for people to be like, Oh, Mondays are horrible. Like, usually the first day of the week determines, like, your attitude of the week. But I never really understood that. Because, like, when I worked, I never really had, like, a consistent schedule. So it's just like, every day is a work day, every day sucks. Like, nothing is a good day. And, like, even when, like, I was in school, like, going to school, like, Monday to Friday, I was like, I think Monday's a good day. Because, like, I didn't see many friends outside of school. Like, I didn't hang out with a lot of people. Badge. Because I was just, like, very, like, nervous and scared to, like, ask people to hang out. Because, like, isn't it, like, anxiety-inducing to, like, ask your friends to do something and just thinking that they'll say no? Anyway, so, like, I- just to avoid that whole ordeal, I just never asked anybody to hang out. So, like, Monday would be, like, the time where I could, like, actually see my friends at school. So, as everybody was, like, grumbling and complaining about Monday, I'm like, no, Monday's a good day. Granted, we're talking about this on a Tuesday, so technically my Monday of the week. Monday's mid. <clears throat> I never, like... I feel like your attitude definitely, like, is the biggest factor. Because, like, if you start off your day thinking, like, oh, today's gonna be a shit day, or, like, yesterday was a bad day, so today's gonna be a bad day, too. Like, I understand that, like, that's a part of, like, anxiety. But also, like... Even just, like, thinking positively can change everything, in my opinion. Like, yes, I'm very- I'm very much, like, a critical person. And, like, yes, I am super negative. But, like, I will also try and see the positive of everything. Because, like, I think- Like, I don't believe in fate, but I think everything happens for a reason. Right? 
Like, that's also tying back into, like, if you treat people nicely, they'll, they'll treat you nice in return. I think, and a lot of times, too, I come off as negative. I think it's just because, like, I'm very blunt with things. Like, I've had friends being like, hey, Megan, can you tone it down a little bit? <laughs> You're being mean. I'm like... I'm not being mean, I'm just being blunt. Yes, I know having trash on the ground does lower my rating, but I have no access. I literally went through all of them. Um, I will pick up the trash. I will do it. I love littering, but... Cause, okay, because the joke I was going to do with the trash is I was going to do like a beach cleanup day and have my sister and her friend come clean my beach. <laughs> I don't know. It was, it was a stupid bit. So yes, I'm going to pick up all my trash at some point. Yeah, I agree. Okay, also Wednesdays were kind of stupid because like everyone would be like, Hump day! You know, fist bump! But it's so fucking stupid. I hate it. It's literally a dumb joke. Okay, let's... Let's buy some more axes, because I went through all four of them. I probably only need two, since they're new. Yeah, I, I chop so many trees every day, like, it's literally not worth upgrading to a, a gold axe. Like, we went through one gold axe a day, I think. So it's literally not worth it. Okay, let's pick up the tires so Nyx doesn't yell at me anymore. <laughs> yeah, because like, I have like all the strictest settings on Automod. Because I don't have many mods. And I'd rather like something be cleared. Before like someone says like actually something bad. Because I think for cursing, I changed my chat rules over the weekend. Um, it should be on my about page. But I changed my chat rules to say cursing will be automated for context. Because like I think I don't mind cursing. Like I think it's fine. Like as long as it's not like targeting someone. Like as long as people aren't saying, "Megan, you're fucking stupid," right? That that's not nice. <laughs> but if someone is saying like, "Fuck." So, like something happening on screen, I think that's fine. So like anytime, but also like it's wild to think that LMFAO got tagged. That that's wild. So chatters, if you get automated, don't worry about it. It happens. It's not you. It's me. <laughs> yeah, there was a reason why that one got tagged. Um. I, w I, I didn't see it, because, like, at the when I actually saw it, something like marker, right, it's a, like, at that point, if I would have, like, allowed it, it would have had no context. So, it was just weird. Like, I would say avoid talking about that type of stuff. I don't know. Like, as I said before, like, keep chat messages, like, relevant to stream, if possible. Like, i.e. keep stuff relevant to, like, what we're talking about. Is it TikTok sound? Really? <laughs> I didn't fucking know. <laughs> no, I'm not a- Okay, I am not- I am not a TikToker. Yes, all of you guys are from TikTok. I love my little zoomers, but I am not a TikToker. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know why I felt like I need to go to full game. But no, I- I feel like- I think TikToker is the lowest tier influencer. Because I feel like TikToks that are popular, they're not really that creative. 
got so scared. <laughs> no, I needed to set the record straight that I'm not a TikToker. Rainy told me off stream. She was like, Megan, you should just go full time into TikTok. I'm like, no. <laughs> Thank you guys. I appreciate it. Um, Cause like, I feel like TikTok, like what is your audience? Like, yes, it's people who enjoy your content, but like, do they actually like you? Like, that's why I think like streaming is like just fun on its own. But like, I get to talk to people, you know? Okay, another thing that I want to talk about, like, automated stuff, um, it will, like, catch stuff, but as I always say, like, chatters, feel comfortable sharing what you're comfortable with, but also, like, keep in mind your own personal safety. Like, I know this is a safe place for people, like, you can talk about yourself, you can talk about your identity, but also keep in mind this is a public platform, so be mindful of, like, people you know IRL, like, finding your content online, like, keep your personal safety in mind as well when you talk about, like, your identity and stuff. Especially if you're younger. That's why, like, Issa, like, not to call you out directly, but, like, that's why I'm a bit more cautious with you, because, like, I know you are younger. And they're, like, maybe you feel like you're safe with your family and that's cool. But, like, a lot of younger people will be targeted, whether it be, like, predators and stuff, so, like... I just have to be mindful of that. I'm so tired. Me too, honestly. But that's why, like, I... I try to be careful with what I allow in chat. No, no, don't, don't get me into fandom wars, please. I don't want to be on Minecraft Twitch. No, Twitter. Please don't do it. Don't do it to me. Because, like, I know for me, like, I'm very open with my identity, but, like, I don't necessarily talk about it all the time. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I gotta be careful. I'm also just very careful with what I, like, talk about. Yeah, I don't leak anything. Like, I don't talk about personal stuff. Um, like, I don't post any pictures near where I live because that's fucking stupid. Um, yeah, don't, don't do it, Katie. <laughs> Exactly. Um, that's why, like, I don't have location on typically for sites. Um, because, like, all it takes is one crazy person. You know what I mean? And then they ruin the fun for everyone. And by that, I mean potentially hurt me or someone I care about. And that's not cool to think about. But anyway, let's change the topic, guys. Let's change the topic. <laughs> let's not talk about this anymore. <laughs> Okay, last thing I'll say, last thing I'll say. It's like, that's also why I try and be as, like, nice as I can online. Like, I don't- okay. I feel like everybody talks shit. I feel like everybody does, but I don't say things publicly. Like, I have my opinions about things, but I don't share all of my opinions. Because, yes, <laughs> Nyx is out here fighting for my life right now. Um, um. Yeah, because it's like, I can know that I'm doing what I feel is the right thing, but online there are so many people who can misconstrue your words or opinions to like fit their narrative, and it's just not something I'm like ready for or I think I can handle. Anyway, that's the last thing I wanted to see. Who's my favorite villager? Um, Aurora, obviously. You guys fucking know that. When we had to delete her my island, you guys know that I fucking cried in the video game when she left. Oh my god, Nyx! Isn't it wild? It is! It is another hour into stream. So you guys know what that means. I know, kind of awkward, but it is ad time! I, it is an hour into stream, so I have to feel my contractual obligation run a few minutes of ads. You can avoid the ad break by subscribing for just $4.99. Just $5! Skip your coffee today and get ad for viewing all month long. Or, if you have an Amazon Prime, you can link it to your Twitch account and get a free Prime sub. My Prime sub went out to Radiant Games this month. You get ad for viewing and cool sub only emotes. And, any secret Oilers, now is the time to give away plebs. I mean, non-subs! 
can have ad reviewing. I did not mean to say blood. I am so sorry. I it slipped out. I you guys are cool. If you don't sub, that's fine. I don't care. I don't care. I was a broke bitch too. I am still a broke bitch. Anyway. We'll see some of you guys in a few. <laughs> okay, now that the non-subs can't hear me. No, I ain't goofing gaff, but seriously, if, if you can't afford to sub, I don't care. Like, I know I myself, I think... Because I, I have a Prime sub, which I get for free. Sub with Prime, easy clap. <laughs> and then I think I have, like, four subs that I pay for. What do you left? That's so fucking funny. Multi-leveled marketing? Is that what MLM stands for? Oh my god. Yeah, honey, we know what it stands for, but multi-leveled marketing is a nice save. <laughs> but, okay. I know I myself, I'm only subscribed to four people. And one, I can only really afford like $25 a month for Twitch. Because like, I, I should not be spending more than that every month, right? Um... And also, like, the four channels that I'm subscribed to are, like, channels that I love the emotes. Like, I have to have the emotes. Because, like, a lot of the channels that I have, like, for example, let me actually show them. Because I, I love them so much. Like, I personally, okay, I know they're big boys. I know they're big boy streamers. Like, I have a sub to Hassan, Miskiv, and Connor Eats Pants. Mainly because I love these three emotes so much. Like, I pay $5 a month just to get those emotes, and I can use them wherever I want. Um, like, everywhere else, like, I wish I could support, like, other people, like, other smaller streamers by subscribing, but I honestly can't. It's, like, it's a lot easier for me to budget out, like, a subscription, because, oh, you know, I have to pay $5 on this day. <laughs> but if I have too many subscriptions, then it's too much, right? If you are watching Twitch on a budget, look up Twitch Turbo. I'm not going to say what it is, but look it up yourself. It is game changing. Okay? Okay. <laughs> Twitch Turbo is kind of like, like an unspoken subscription for Twitch. It's amazing though. Look it up, guys. Look it up, chatters. Um, anyway. <laughs> Your emotes are so cool. Thank you, Mag. I appreciate it. I think you said before you subbed right away because you like the emotes and the vibes. So let's go. I'm glad people like the emotes. Um, what was I gonna do? Oh, we need to buy some clothes. <laughs> but what was I saying? So like, I find it better personally. May I bring up COVID? Are you feeling okay, Issa? Because I know you were feeling icky last week. I hope you're doing fine, hun. Um, what was I saying? <laughs> that is a cool pattern that she's sewing right now, like, actually. Oh, we're not gonna get it. Fuck me. Um, I was talking about emotes and then subs. Oh, I think it's a lot better, personally, to, like, cheer bits in a channel, because it's a lot easier to, like... As you guys know, which takes a cut of the subscriptions. Oh no, everybody knows. Um, it's all public information. I can't say what it is, but Twitch takes a cut, right? But like for bits, I feel like it's a lot easier to like conceptualize how much the streamer is getting. Because as everyone knows, like one bit equals one penny. I like chunky jewelry, but I don't like how this sits on my head. I feel like this would be cuter if it was like on the side of my head. So I'm not buying it. Um... Oh, I'm sorry. Was it not covered? Are, what? Are you on state insurance or are you on, like, copay? But you're probably still on your parents, huh? But that sucks. I hope you're doing okay. I, I'm glad you're fine, though. Like, I'm glad you were able to, like, get medical attention. Because, guys, Chatter, seriously, if you're feeling sick and if you're having difficulty breathing, 
in any stance, I, I it's better to get evaluated at the hospital. Because any type of, like, like ailment should be taken seriously. And I know hospitals are scary, but they are there to help you. Oh. Dude, that COVID fatigue. I- okay. Before we dive into it more. There we go. If you're not vaccinated, please do so. If you're eligible for a booster, please get your booster. I am fully boosted. I'm probably gonna get my second booster shot. I'm probably gonna be eligible in like August. So if you haven't already, get your shots, get your boosters. If you are have concerns about COVID, visit the CDC website or talk to your doctor. They will help you address your concerns. Um, yeah, let's fucking go. Dude, I want to get as many fucking boosters as I can. Like, give me that shit right in my veins. Because, like, I am previously asthmatic, so I I'm moderate risk for severe illness. But since I'm vaccinated, my likelihood of getting hospitalized is a lot slimmer. Like, the vaccine helps people. And, like, I'm still anxious about, like, getting COVID. But, like, mainly because, like, long COVID. Like, there's, there's some people who can't taste, who can't smell, who have infinite fatigue. Okay, um... I kind of want to do you laugh, you lose now. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> I'll, I'll do the rest of this shit online, because, like, I forgot I didn't water the flowers. Oopsie! So I'll, I'll do this offline, I promise. But TLDR, what we did today, Plucky is leaving. We gave Gail a present. I showed off my new... Yeah, funny times now, exactly. <laughs> I showed off my new flower setup. I need to rearrange this. Like, this will look better, hopefully, by Thursday. Because I'll move this house tonight, and then I'll rearrange the flowers on Thursday. But, yeah, so seriously, if you guys are sick, make sure you go to the hospital if you're feeling any severe or, like, change in, like, condition. Because it's not worth staying at home and potentially getting more sick or, like, getting more severe side effects. So. Because <laughs> it's, like, if I have difficulty breathing right now, normally, dude, if I get COVID, I'm gonna get fucked. <laughs> I'm glad you're doing better now though, Issa. I really am. Because I was worried about it. I was like, oh. Because like, when you hear that people are sick, there's nothing you can really do to like help, you know? Because um, like, you can offer support, but like, if you're not like there, like helping take care of them, there's not, not, not much you can really do and it sucks. You're eligible for a second booster, let's go! Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and set up. You laugh, you lose. Oh, also, chatters, chatters. If you don't know already, I'm doing a market tournament next, next Sunday. If you place top three, you get VIP in chat. Isn't that fucking sick? <laughs> Yeah. I wish, like, if you were sick, you could just, like, do nothing. Because, like, I know with remote learning, like, like, I heard of some students who, like, got COVID and they still had to show up to, like, lectures and stuff and still had to turn in homework. But it's like, if this was, like, actual school, you would get an extension. Because, like, you shouldn't have to worry about, like, one, stressing yourself out and, like, physically exhausting yourself more, especially when you're sick. Like, I believe everyone should get an extension. I just don't get it. Like, I've said this story before, but, like, I had an evacuation notice in my area. And, like, I still had to turn in my homework. It was fucking stupid. It's because my professor didn't answer my email in time. It was fucking dumb. <clears throat> You've been practicing? I'm glad to hear that, Nyx. You know, we play to have fun. If you've placed top three, that's pretty hard. That's cool. But like I said, if I place top three, 
and only two chatters get top three, then only two people are getting badges. So I've been practicing too, mind you. <laughs> okay, you have good time. Got my actual real headsets. Let's lighten the mood a little bit, guys. So you guys know the rules. If I laugh, I end stream. If you laugh in chat, type one and tell me what made you laugh. I can pause. I can smile. But I, I just can't laugh. That's it. I just can't laugh. That's <laughs> <laughs> so fucking stupid. <clears throat> okay, you guys ready? Okay, just the fact that the cat like dashed away is funny. <laughs> I didn't laugh. I thought he was saying bet. Like, ah, uh, bet. But he was saying bed. Oh, you're right there, are playing FNAF. Okay, I got scared. Because you guys see the water? See how it's red? I understand this brick, but I dead ass thought they fucking cut the cat. I legit got scared. I didn't laugh though, because that's not funny. A cat dying is not funny. But I saw the brick and I got really fucking scared. I was like, no, please don't, no. This is supposed to be funny time. Wait, that guy's gonna pay $20 an hour to pet a cat. Unfair. Oh, no. Oh my god, he's fell through the fucking room. Oh, dude, that crunch. Jesus. Wait, Cameron, there's nothing to block your phone. No one gives a like, fuck calling. Right, no one gives a fuck calling. One. All right, I'm letting go. Oh my god, is that my plushie? That's some spy shit. Watch his commercials. Just a measured and installed just for you. Built to last forever. Call today for a free consultation. If you support Joe Biden and are a liberal, don't call us. <laughs> <laughs> no fucking libs. Welcome to VB. Oh shit, it's just like Jenga. Sad day. Oh? Oh? Uh, Dude, that looks like fucking mousetrap. There he is. I fucking hate my jokes. Oh my god. Okay. I am peak comedy. Show him that you know how to swim. What the fuck is you doing? What the fuck? Homie had to like hit the vape before. Like, no shot. That was real, like, steam. Oh, dude, wow. RBG chair. It's like. That is peak.
Oh my god. Hola amigo de aquí, le voy a presentar mi chibote. Puro de mental, puro de mental. Did you see him struggle? I'm trying to sleep. Wait, watch the cat. I'm trying to sleep. <laughs> Hi, Scoot. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing well. Dude, these fucking Mario edits. They're so good. Every single day and not get tired of My sink's fine. Love you too, man. Oh, there's a phone. And that was like a sign. This area right here. What happens here is not my goddamn business. I don't give a fuck what happens here. Oh. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. There's like steam coming out of its mouth. The cat was deep roasting. Oh, dude. All I can do is pour a cup of monster and calm the fuck down. I'll try, but no guarantee. Dude, I wanted the, the bit to, to go on longer. Hi, hacker. Who driving this bug? <laughs> So many people are just like it's not, it's not losing their food. It's gonna hit them. I hate that shit. I hate that shit. Dude, he's getting all the pussy tonight, isn't he? Oh, No. That was just cool. <laughs> Not like this. <laughs> That was good. That was good. That was a good one. I, I almost got got. I'm in a really good mood today. I almost got got. Anybody get got? Looks like Issa got got. Got uh! Got got twice! Okay, I need to eat lunch. That was good. That was good. Okay, okay. So, well, what is next on the to-do list? Oh yeah, okay. <clears throat> so... We did have two donations today, so I'm going to go ahead, get some music on, and set up the journal. If you are new to stream, what we're doing right now is anybody who subscribes, cheers, donates, gives bits, gets their name written on our subjournal. So I linked in chat the massive Twitter thread of all the previous Super donations. Mario 3D yeah. I, I swear. Some three world music has to be the best, like hands down. No nothing beats it. Okay, so. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> I was like, I forgot how to set it up for a second. I blanked. Okay.
Dude, the app I use is so fucking glitchy, it's annoying. Mario 3D All-Stars? What game is that? Do you mean the party one? Why not get both? Easy. Because, <laughs> like, in my head, I understand the argument that games are expensive, but also... Oh, the game pack! Oh, okay, I know what you're talking about now. I would say get it. Like, save up for both. Like, honestly. Yeah, I gotta re I gotta rearrange my desk. Don't worry. If I give both, I can't give subs. I'm fine. You know, I know you're goofing. I know you're joking. But don't feel obligated to give shit. I don't, I don't care. Because, like, in my head, if a game costs, like... $60, how many, like, hours of entertainment is that going to give you? Like, probably infinite hours. So it's like, I will gladly cop up $50, 60 for a game. I don't care. Moving my computer. Don't knock her off the desk. Don't do it. Don't do it. This is just, like, I love this part of stream because, you know, I like showing off my awesome calligraphy. But also, I get legit so scared. I'm gonna knock everything off my desk, waste my $2,000 computer, okay, do not disturb on his own, we're not gonna leak it. True, I agree. Because I'm very much like... I hate this. I don't understand why she doesn't connect properly every time. There we go. Cam's there. Let's fucking go. Um. Because I'm very much like, I feel like I need to finish a game before I get a new one. Because part of me feels like I neglect a game if I don't play it, right? Like, when I bought new games, I didn't play Animal Crossing for literal ages. But, I don't know. Okay. Just play Odyssey again, easy clap. <laughs> okay, so we had Not Mac give the tier 1. You have to finish any of the games? Well, get on it, Issa. You gotta beat them. Do it right now. After you do your homework. <laughs> hey, look at this. You're on this page twice, not Mac. Look. You're on here twice. Let's go. Because, like, I usually don't completionist games because I feel like that's a bit much. But I definitely try and be like the main stories and try and get collectibles. But, like, I'm not a die-hard gamer. Because I feel like I get... Not necessarily annoyed. But, like... What's the right word? Oh, cool. Thank you for redeeming that. So we'll write your name next. In the other journal. Not annoyed, but you get bored of a game if you play it too much. Like, that's definitely why I like... Playing games just for stream and then having games just for offline. I think that's a big reason why I stopped playing Unite on stream. Because, like, Unite has become my offline game. <laughs> I don't have the energy to <laughs> do homework and play games, Sag. Feels bad, man. I feel it. Like, 
I'm trying to change my schedule in a way, like my personal schedule, where I'm like, I'm trying to do work in the morning first. Like, I'll try and like do a little bit of homework or studying. And also like, do some editing before a stream. Cause I know after stream, I'm usually like dead tired. Like I can't do much. Like I used to just chill, like watch a stream or watch a video or something. <laughs> okay, that was all on camera. I thought it was out of frame and I got sad. <laughs> yeah, I agree, Nyx. Like I very much I replay games all the time. Like I think I wanna go back and do Odyssey again. I don't know. I definitely- I would like to, like, get into speedrunning at some point. Because when you're doing that, you're just playing the game over and over again. Okay, we had not Mac. Zero gifted. Tier 1 sub to chat. Let's go. Okay, I gotta get the other journal for Issa. Um... I'm feeling magenta for you today, Issa. Kind of this red violety purple, almost. If you don't know, chatters, in the bottom left corner of your chat box, you can redeem I'll write your name on Q and stuff for only 750 points. And you'll get the same amount of attention. <laughs> and I'll write your name. D got redeemed it as well. Let's go. But thank you. We'll write your name next, D Gone. Okay, okay, I don't know about y'all. But I noticed I've been like. <laughs> Nick story time. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> uh, what was I saying? When I get excited, like today, I noticed like. I stutter a lot today. I think it's because, like, I was genuinely, like, excited and in a good mood. Because I just noticed when, I, when I'm nervous, I stutter. Like, I cringe so much when I, like, look back at old clips. Like, I think that sucks the most when I, like, go and edit TikToks. Is that I have to cut out a lot of my stuttering. And I'm not too self-conscious about it. It's just, like, I know it's annoying for some people. But, you know, it's fine. Because, like, the thing I like about streaming... Is that, it, in general, it's like helping with my speaking skills, you know? Been lurking, but no, no problem. I love my lurkers. You guys are all pretty cool. Because <laughs> I know a lot of people like shit on lurkers, but... If you look at, like, big streamers, like, not everyone is chatting. And, like, I think it's times, you know? Like, it's nice to have a voice in the background. So, you know, lurkers... The controller's still out, Sag. Weren't you talking about that controller for months, Issa? <laughs> okay, so we got Degon. <laughs> yes, Sedge. Oh, it's not on cam. There we go. There we go. We had D gone. <laughs> what? Cancer? Who knew? Okay. We have one more name to write because we had Rainy D Games tip $5. Also, any other chatters want to redeem Ram and Amal Keys? So now is the time to do it. Rainy is going to be pink, obviously. another page. So this will go on Twitter later today or tomorrow. It'll be tomorrow if I forget today. I feel like everything can give you cancer. Literally. Literally. I have to prep this next page. So four from the top. Oh my god, I prepped it! Oh my god, I fucking love past Megan. Okay, if you don't know, um, can't really see it on cam. But 
you can kind of see it. I put guide dots here. That way I know how high my letters have to be. But dude, past Megan did a few pages already. Dude, I love past Megan. Okay, next is Rainy Day Games, who tips $5. I'm gonna go probably give somebody a sub with that money, Lobo. Wait, I didn't change my title! <laughs> Mods. There we go. <laughs> Mod check. I know. Omega Low. Also, gentle reminder, guys. Here. Where is it? Here. Here. If we hit 50 subs, chat will get three new emotes. If we hit 50, we'll get three new emotes. I know I say that every time, but we are close. We've been close for a few weeks now. Okay, back to it. I think Rainy's name is one of my favorites to write. Because I personally like drawing Ys a lot. Because just the thick to thin and then the thick stroke for the, the tail, I think is really pretty. do like calligraphy streams all the time I would do it I know it's not necessarily the most engaging content but it's fun for me to write and also I know chatters like seeing me write to some capacity I don't know okay <clears throat> dude her name is so fucking long I don't have any room it's fine it's fine Okay, so we had a rainy day games for the $5 donation. Let's go ahead and add some accent lines. If you are just coming in, what we're doing right now, if you subscribe, cheer, give bits, donate, you get your name written in my special sub journal. There's a link to a massive Twitter thread in the chat room. I would like to do... We don't talk about that next. We don't talk about it. <laughs> um, I would like to do more calligraphy streams in general. Like, I think once a month on Twitch is pretty good. Like, that's not too crazy. I would like to do them on TikTok, but like, if I could do it on TikTok, I would love to do it with like my actual like DSLR cam. Cause like, I know this is my phone cam right here, but if you could see the shit in like HD, oh, he's so good. Remember when Slash Day would trigger the command? I know, I know. Those were the good days, weren't they? What, two days ago? <laughs> Not two days, but probably like a few days ago. Good old days. Okay. <clears throat> so that does it. Unless anybody else wants to redeem the channel for redemption or donate, maybe. Yes, literally last Wednesday. <laughs> okay. Um... I think we're gonna go ahead and call it a day here. Like, I don't know if we're gonna raid today. Let's see if anybody is live. Sag, no, none of my friends fucking stream at this time. Sorry, I'm not, I'm not mad. I'm, I'm goofing. <laughs> I'm joking. But yeah, I hope you have a good day, Maggot. Um, yeah. As always, it was a good time. I know today was a good day. I was in a really good mood, like, all day. So, you guys always make my day better. And it, today was just... Yeah, no more Katie. <laughs> Lobo. Um, but you guys generally do make my day better. 
Like, you really do. I, I say it all the time, but, like, it feels like I'm talking to friends, and it's really nice. Um, so, yeah. Before I head out, once again, thank you to anybody who came in the stream. Any chatters, lurkers, gifters, donators, I appreciate everyone. I hope you guys enjoy the stream. Um, as I said earlier, like, I was thinking about, like, content and, like, the ethics of content. But I'm glad people like the stream. I'm glad people... Well, stick around and hang out with me for hours every day. Like, that's still wild. <laughs> Even my friends won't fucking do that. Anyway, I I appreciate you guys a lot. I really do. Um, before I go, before I go, you can check out my offline stuff. I have a Twitter, Instagram, and a TikTok. If you aren't already, go follow my Twitter. You'll get updates about myself, about stream, all that kind of cool jazz. Okay. Oh, also, also, we're doing a Mario Kart tournament next, not next, the uh, next, next Sunday. So make sure you guys are practicing your lines. It is a no items tournament. So practice your lines, practice the skips. That'll be next, next Sunday, May 29th at 10 a.m. Pacific. It starts at 11, but warm up start at 10. So be there or be square. You will get a cool, shiny VIP badge if you play top three. So <laughs> I'll see you guys tomorrow. Same time, 11 a.m. PST, we're doing more Kirby. I think we're just going to continue with the story mode. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.